kit to make sure you have all the essentials to join in with the fun. With round nose, flat nose and wire cutter pliers, as well as a reamer, tweezers and a bead scoop, you've got everything you need in one place for just $9.95. We provide the tools, you provide the skills. When you place your first order with us, you will receive a free booklet and DVD full of handy hints, tips and tutorials to help you get started with your new Jewellery Maker hobby. You can now keep in touch by liking Jewellery Maker UK on Facebook. Get interactive with Jewellery Maker. There are two easy ways to purchase from Jewellery Maker. You can watch our show on Sky, Virgin, Freeview or Freesat and call our free phone number where you'll be put through to our friendly help team who can place your order. Alternatively, you can go to our website and click the sign up button. Once you have filled in the required details, you can start shopping. You can watch the show by clicking the on air now button on the front page. You can also use our quick search tool and narrow down your results. Once you have found an item that you like, you simply click on the buy now button and the item will be added to your basket. Don't forget that you can add as many items to your basket per day for only one p and Enjoy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Hello, hello, and welcome to Jewelry Maker this Saturday morning where we are absolutely thrilled to have your company because we have got so much in store for you. Today I am joined by the wonderful Lady Oxberry. Good hello, morning. darling. Good morning. How are you? How are well. you? Yeah, good, thank you. Very good. Hannah, tell everybody what you've got in store today. I've got... Um, new tools, brand new tools, and we've got a crazy half hour clearance as well. Exciting. <laughs> the tool does something, I don't know what, but it looks good. You know when you're like, I don't know what this is, but it looks amazing. It's all tooly. It looks like something that only Hannah Roxbury and it looks all tooly. It's like, <laughs> wow, this does something good. It's not just a stick. <laughs> There's a lot of elements to this. And actually, in fact, Laura Binding, who has many people on her workshop today, <laughs> is now doing the having a go. She's having a go with it. Look at all those. Look at them all. There's never going to be any room at the buffet this afternoon, no, is there? I'm getting oh. a bit worried. Oh. <laughs> now we have got so many wire twisters back in stock. Ryan Josh, how excited are we by that? So excited. We're really excited. We got that. We got so many incredible deals for you today. We got half an hour of sales. Half an hour of sales. We have got chain, chain, chain in the uh, voice of Lucy. We have got so much going on today. Look at that. Oh, oh la la. It's a bit sexy. Uh, it is sexy Saturday today, I've just decided. I'm going to give you genuine suede. It smells heavenly like a cowboy. Now, <laughs> it does. It does smell like a cowboy. Now have a look. No, it smells all leathery. Not like horses. <laughs> suede. Oh. Look at this colour. This is gorgeous. This is genuine. Oh, it just smells amazing, doesn't it, suede? Now you've got this times two. Oh no, these are different colours. No, they're not. This times two. Shall I get it all out? Shall I? Oh, Cass hates me. Now, suede. Suede is brilliant if you do Laura Binding style big pendants. So to thread it through and hold on to a pendant, perfect. Now, suede is also great. Um, I would love to know where the soutache that Sarah Alvin did was because out of suede, because it was great. Yeah, it, was. it was wonderful, wasn't it, Hans? She made a lovely pair of earrings as well. 
Um, loving Sarah Alvin's designs at the moment. Uh, what else can you do with suede, Hannah Roxbury? Uh, macrame, you could try macrame can with you? it. With suede? Yeah, yeah, if you um, lay them out so they're flat and then just keep remembering to sort of ease them into place rather than just going for it. You have to keep turning them so they're correct. But, but yeah, you can macrame with them. Now, Hannah, suede is typically quite an expensive uh, material, isn't it, in, yeah. in um, comparison to other, uh, other cottons and laces that are available in haberdashery stores. Leather, leather, any kind of leather, as we know, leather jackets, leather boots tend to be more expensive. Um, I love the smell of this alone, it's just enough to get me excited. Now, I absolutely love the colours. I think just if you're doing a lot of big pendants, just to have something nice and simple. But it can also be masculine. Would you agree with that? Yeah, I definitely agree. You've got um, a nice texture to it as well. Mm. But it, even though it's very, very bright in the colours, it's still quite understated. It's not too over the top. Because it's not shiny, yeah, I, think, I think. Because right it's there. matte. Yeah. It's definitely the texture of this, I think. And I just reckon you could also use this if you were really posh in very <laughs> fancy packaging. Darling. <laughs> you know, it would be like something mega expensive looking, wouldn't it? Now, I'm going to give you all of this genuine leather suede, not for a price tag you are going to expect. Sorry, I've just, I've got I've stolen Hannah Oxbury's necklace. Love it. And it's banging against my microphone, so it looks like I'm going to have to release it from my clutches. <laughs> release it into the wild. Fly, my pretties, fly. <laughs> uh, now we're going to give you all of this for the most incredible deal. It is, after all, Saturday morning. Welcome to the weekend at £6.95. You've got yourself an incredible deal. Wonderful to have you with us. There's one of two ways in which you can come and grab this deal. 0800 644 on the phones. It is a free phone number if you're dialing from a UK landline. You can get involved via the power that is the website. The web. Uh, all the W's don't do any maker. This is me being the web. If I was doing drama school and I was being the web, this is what I would do. This is me in cyberspace and being the web. <laughs> Uh, you can do that, jewelrymaker.com. Are you, what are you being, the web? Kangaroo I'm style? Are you swing, swimming through the web, are you? Yeah. Okay, £6.95 <laughs> is your price tag with a 30 day money back guarantee. You cannot go wrong if this is your first purchase, my darling jewelry makers, ever, ever, ever in the world, ever with us here at Jewelry Maker. You will receive not just your gorgeous suede in all those fabulous colours, but also a free tutorial DVD, a step by step book, and every month through your door. For now, a JM Hub magazine, because we love you. Six ninety five for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, six, seven, twenty. I could have just times ten by two, couldn't I? But as we all know, I wasn't blessed with what they call brains. Six ninety five. Whew. Now, I have got for you. Can I show you something exceptional? Well, actually, I've got quite a few exceptional things. There we go, Cass. You'll have fun with that, my lover. <laughs> yeah? Now, I've got for you... Da, 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 tanzanite. It does deserve a, f a fanfare. And anyway, I'm trying to get the theme tune of Bergerac out of my head. Don't know... What, was it Bergerac I was singing? Don't know. Why is that in my head? I've woke up with it in my head. I've been dreaming about crime. Now, <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> Beautiful. What do you dream about that's weird? Give us a text, 60777, James Studio, followed by your message. What weird things did you dream? Did you have a weird dream last night, lady? Oxbury? Um, no. Oh. No, not that I remember. How boring. <laughs> no. <laughs> How boring of your sleepy self. I'll, I'll give me more time, I'll make something up. Okay, no, I want it to be real. Because then I can analyse it. Move okay. to that. Now, I have got something else exceptionally exceptional for you. Oh, you're going to love today. Who, who does not love today? We never have this. Never, 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 never. Vicky Carr had some the other day, but only because she stole it from me. Have a look. She didn't really. Have a look at this. Oh. 
Look at the, look, Hannah, oh, oh, just oh, oh. Morganite. Morganite pendants, Oliver is singing, oh, 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 it's magic. I love these. Which one should I do next? These are so, so pretty. Have a look. Oh, these are singing, aren't they? You know, they're just, look at the sparkle. Oh dear, these really are a bit too luxurious, aren't they? Oh gosh, don't you think they, they should be like underneath a sign that says Cartier or Tiffany & Co or Boodles, you know? That kind of in a thick glossy magazine draped around the neckline of Kate Moss style gemstones, isn't it? <laughs> Now look at this, A up ducks, look at what I've got for you. Now these are powerful. <gasps> oh, look at, wow. How much are we excited about already? I'm excited about uh, really wetting my whistle this morning. Now have a look. Can I, can I do it now? Thank you. Ta -da! Look at this, this is properly amazing. Now look, look, oh, I don't know, I've got to put it on. Oh, Hannah. This is the best sapphire we've ever had. Well, one, certainly, certainly top two. Oh, definitely. The colour in that strand is oh. just so vibrant. It is going to be a considered purchase. But look at the depth of blue. Look at that pink. You've even got peach sapphire in there. That does not happen. No. Almost Papadashka colours in there too. Now, this really is, this really is a real in fact it's a ro it's royalty as far as any of the other strands i mean this is except look, look at the clarity of the, of the you've got different depths of blue i can't even speak it's that incredible <laughs> you know when you just look at something and think i it is breathtaking it's m uh, amazing it's an opportunity that we just don't get very many of and i i love that you're here to share it with me today can I can I show you another strand? I said to Laura, oh, I love that. And what I loved it for was its colour and its the texture of these, because not really shiny. I think these are going to be wonderful at Christmas time. Um, but I love the fact that they're matte. Aren't they great? Now everyone's just going, oh yes, yes. Look at these. Now we were talking yesterday about Indiana Jones stones. These these look like them, don't they? They are genuine ruby, and they will be going under ten pounds. I did say that ruby under ten pounds. Would you like some sterling silver? Because I got it coming up very soon. You're not going to have to wait very long for this sterling silver, my darlings. <gasps> mm hmm. I do like the way Cass has put it like that. That's very elegant, Cass. She's got style, this one. Wow, and she makes good cuppers. She makes good cuppa. Also got some lovely sunstone. Do you know what we should do every day in life? Challenge Hannah Oxbury in some way. Whether it's with a, um, do, you know, do you know, I took my son to football yesterday and you know when someone says, do you like riddles? And I'm like, not, not really, but you're gonna, t <laughs> you know, I ain't got the brain for it, mate. Um, but he's told it me anyway. I ain't got the brain for it, mate. I'm trying to watch me son and I. Uh, he was like, listen to this, and like, use this, I'll have you. Oh, well, I wish he'd never said it, because all day, and I now know the answer, but he said there's a set of twins. One's 20 and one's 22. How so? Yeah, this will annoy you all day. There you go, have that. Annoying, isn't it? That man did that to... You know, have you heard it before? You just Googled it, well done. <laughs> what a cheater. What an absolute massive cheater. What an absolute massive cheater. It's the way I said it. You've got a set of twins, sorry, not two sets of twins, a set of twins. One's 20 and one's 22. Okay, how so? Oh, okay, so... They Don't give it away, text in, <laughs> 6077, followed by your message. Now, <laughs> so I've challenged Hannah in that Ridley way, 
I'm also gonna I'm also gonna challenge Hannah in another way. So let's do that. Maybe we should do morning riddles with jewellery maker. <laughs> That's what we'll do. Better than crossword, isn't it? Let's have a look at what I've got for Hannah. Well, I think Hannah's gonna find this easier than the riddle I just gave to her. <laughs> now look at what you've got. Beautiful blues. So delight in little plump drops. Actually, do you know what? I'm going to show you these individually because you're going to love it. Oh, Hannah, you've got those. Oh, Hannah, this isn't a challenge. You've requested this, you little monster. Now, I know what she's done. She's used the power of management <laughs> to get what she wants again. Note, note I said again. Now, have a look. These are little plump teardrops. These are lovely, you know, really lovely. And then I'm going to give to you, Hannah Oxbury, mm. my darling gem, some bridal blue. I think this is bridal blue, or it could be christening blue. You know, that lovely baby blue. Gorgeous. And then I'm going to give you peacock blue. Oh, I like this a lot. I like this a lot. So far, so good, yeah? And then I'm going to give you... Oh, look at more gorgeous sewed light rounds but this time the sewed light's deeper richer darker i think blue can be icy and wintry but it can also be summery let's stick on the winter theme today because that's what you're doing well i'm not going to tell hannah what to do actually she's much better and knows exactly what she's doing now you've got these lovely leaves 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 I don't know. You know, sometimes you forget the ability of speech, which is a big hindrance when you're in the uh, talking game. Now, in the talking game, what do you do for a living? I talk. You've got a pair of leaf earring blanks. Now, these don't have to be for earrings. These could be going in a charm bracelet. Let's see what Hannah does. Now, I'm also going to give you three bead caps. I think we're spoiling her. We're spoiling you. Now, Laura's just said in my ear, oh, this is going to be literally like this, a shocking, shocking price. Oh, she did like little oh, 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 oh. a little bit like um, if you're a witch, but the opposite. Now, oh, more like a little leprechaun, a little giggle of a cheeky little leprechaun. <laughs> like a witch, but op you, you know, like a witch, but opposite. Like. <laughs> My six-year-old self has come back. Mummy, you know like a witch, but opposite. No. What's the opposite of witch? Snow. I don't know. Who knows? Wizard. <laughs> and then you've got... Uh, so these are sterling silver, the seamless bicones. Pair of sterling silver shepherd's hooks is what you've got. I'm just looking up there. To see. It's called Special Occasion. You've got all your beading materials. And, of course, Hannah Oxbury. I'm even going to give you all the findings to go with. Easy peasy lemon squeezy for Hannah's challenge today. So let's see what she does. Maybe she's going to mix mediums. Maybe she's going to go, ooh, we've got purse bags. Not in that accent. That's not what she does in her voice. That's mine. We got pearl specs. I think I might mix it up a little bit. Who knows? This kit is going crazy low. Two strands of pearls you'd pay what for already? You have got your light blue straight drill culture pearls. They're Baroque and they're eight by six. Winter wedding, says Ollie Pops. Peacock culture pearls, they're seven by five. Soda light pears, 10 by eight. Plump drops, I called them. Soda light plate mounds, eight mil. Your sterling silver seamless cones, you got three of those. And a pair of leaf earrings. And the shepherd's in sterling silver. 50 metres of beading thread, 80 metres of monofilament, and over 6 metres of clear elastic. We're going to give you all of this for under 20 nika. You must be mad, mate. 19 pounds 95 pence. Have you got our riddle of the morning? If so, give us a text. 60 James Studio, followed by your message well done to everyone that's buzzing around the phone i say it is lovely to have your company hannah oxbury throw me some inspiration uh, yeah well i'm gonna mix it up with oh i'm gonna mix it up with some perspex because i've got my perspex oh with me goody today. so lovely we shall see i might try a few new techniques 
and just see where it goes. But I think, like you say, this is perfect. Like Ollie said, winter wedding. I'm even thinking with the lighter blue brocks, Mother of the Bride, maybe like a little fascinator or something. Who knows? Mother of the Bride. Does the mother, yeah, well, Oliver's just saying, doesn't the mother of the bride traditionally wear blue? I should know this. It's going to be the only wedding I ever organise. Now, um, <laughs> I can't wait to do Mia's wedding. I said to her the other day, let's have one of those ice sculptures. <laughs> let's have an ice sculpture. Mia would like it to be really understated. And I'll be like, no, that's not happening. Let's have a massive party at 1995. <laughs> Oliver just said, here come the red arrows. <laughs> like, woo! Oh dear, poor, poor child. Now, I'm going to give to you... I'm going to give to you some else gorgeous. So, Hannah, you're all right now. You know what you're doing. I'm good, thank Everything's you. Everything's all right. You're going to give us something cool. Mm-hmm. OK. Come on, you. There we are. I'm just coming, Cassie. Don't worry. Here we go. There you go, darling. Give that to Lady Oxbury. Oh, way up. Can't pick that up with my nails. I'll slide it over to you. How do you pick up? Look at Cass's nails, everybody. Look how long they are. All presenters here would love red nails. We're not allowed them. Look at that. It's very sexy. Go on. Now, <laughs> I don't know why I stroked her and said that. Oh, Cass, Cass like, oh, get me away from this weird woman. Now. <laughs> Ooh, what should we do now, Laura Dora? Which box should we go to? I think we should go to box 10. Is that all right? Now, we're not doing, tw we'll do 12 in a minute. Now, I'll tell you why I wanted to do these, because garnet, this garnet has got the wow factor for me. It is garnet, isn't it, that's coated? I really, I, I launched this a, a while ago, not ages, a couple of weeks. Now, what really, really threw me was that this wasn't twenty nine ninety five, because look, don't you think it's a Don't you think it's lovely? Absolutely shimmering, and it's coated with silver, so it makes it very reflective. Now, for me, I don't know about you, but isn't this a really Christmassy strand? Isn't this the one that's going to make that? It's the colour. I love it. I do think, you know, you look at these and you think sparkly and you think Christmassy. You always hear those sleigh bells, can't you? Look at that. Really love this strand. It's a, a big favourite of mine. And then look at, look at that. Oh! Violet pyrite. Oh, it's the first time I've actually seen this violet pyrite. Love it. They really, they really match up well. You need this for Christmas time. And then I'm going to give you some Labradorite. Now, this, it's all about, a fa I think this is a fairy tale bundle, actually. I think it's a bit of a, um, it, it's a bit of a fairy tale pantomime with the sparkle and the glitz and the glamour and a little bit of magic just squeezed in there as well. I love it. I really like this. Hannah, I, I'm thinking Christmas. I'm thinking sparkly party time jewellery. What yeah. exactly would that entail? Well, you can make an incredible, um, some sort of fascinator from this if you yeah. really want to glitz it up and go really glamorous for a night out. But this bundle works beautifully with one of our kits we've got coming up. <laughs> the Labradorite is incredible. I, no, I, I, no, they're all incredible. I love mm. them. I don't know where I want to put them, but I know I've got the vibe. Did you ever get that? You see this combination, you think, right, I love these colours. I love this shimmer. I love this absolute glamour puss collection. What am I going to do with it? Maybe, mmm, I want to make a necklace. I want it to be like, wow, in mm. your face. Three, these are, Laura just said, these are gonna sell out. TJG sees it, you don't wanna miss out on this one. Three gorgeous wow factor strands. Where are you going? For 12 95 what's that? Four pounds each, five, six, seven, eight, four, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. 12 pounds something each. 12 pound 30, four pound 30 each. Fantastic. Rosanna's made something. Have a look at this. This is pretty. Actually, this is very pretty. Have a look. Woohoo! And the earrings. 
earrings. That's my favourite thing that Welsh people say is earrings. My friend Lynn, I told you my friend Lynn rang me and went, Sean's had her ears pierced. I was like, I laughed for about four hours. I kept going, kept going around and saying to my kids, Sean's had her ears pierced. They're like, what is wrong with you today, Mummy? Don't you think that's great? I love it. Brilliant. Now. Absolutely wonderful. I love it. For £12.95 pence. I think you've got something gorgeous. Very glamorous. Now, my little, my little twister tools. Let's give you something else gorgeous. Good morning, Kirsty. Yeah. What are you doing? I'm just nosing around, you know, like I do. I'm you can't just saunter in here. Yeah. What are you doing? I'm, I'm playing with that new toy. You can't come for a private word with Hannah. That's not <laughs> how it works here. If you're coming in here, you, then you'll have to share uh, your knowledge. Tell us what's going on in the workshop, please. Today we have intermediate wire work with the lovely Laura. So she's got a, a full house this morning. She how many are in there? Um, 13. <laughs> now, have you ordered enough food for this buffet? Yes, there's enough food for you, Jenny, if that's what you want. And will there be cheese? Uh, I don't know. I think ring cheese. them now and request cheese, please. Yeah. Just tell yeah. them, don't even come in the building if you haven't got a cheese today. <laughs> I'll phone them and tell them just the Just say it, yeah, because I don't want to have one of them tantrums like okay. I had last time. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> I didn't, I didn't. Okay, so we're uh, you're trying out the new tool. We've got a new tool for you a little bit later on. It's coming up. Kirst has had a play with it. Ha well, we couldn't get it off Laura Binded and she just brought it back. Laura was like, gimme, gimme, gimme. So a real tool that you must, must have. If Laura Binding's stolen it off Hannah Oxbury, it's all been going on this morning. Now, Let's give you our first kit of the day. It's called Jewels of the Night. We're live! <laughs> <Sorry>. <laughs> we'll just let them get on with it, shall we? Look at her! What is this? What is this? Do you know what you remind me of? Have you ever seen French and Saunders where they do the news sketch and they're like, they're like in the background making a load of noise. That's you two. French and blinking Saunders over there. Do you remember that was so funny? I love that sketch. Okay, that's fine. I'm leaving now. Bye. Are you finished? Are you quite finished? Yeah, I'll be back in a minute. Yeah, I expect you will. No. <laughs> it's a good job we love her. It's a good job we love her. Have a look at this. Oh la la. Beautiful black drops of tourmaline that are top drilled. Hang on a minute, this isn't tourmaline, this is hyperstone. Hypersthene, yeah. What is that? I've not, is it like, what is hypersthene? It's, um, it's a gemstone in its own right, but it's very closely related to things like labradorite and lavakite. It's like lamillion. A bit like Lemonian, yeah. It's got a really lovely shiller It's got the stripes, it. yeah. I just looked at it and thought, hang on a minute. Is this a rare gemstone? Can you see it? Can you see the shiller? Hannah, talk to me about this gemstone. It's very exciting. It's oh, not isn't it a coincidence? It went in your kit. <laughs> what a coincidence, <laughs> I, everybody. Unfortunately, I don't get to choose my kit. So if I could, I would. Um, but this is a really beautiful kit to work with. And actually, it's um, fibrous inclusions within the gemstone that refract the light to give this beautiful shiller. I love it. I've never seen it. Yeah, we, have, we don't get it in a lot. We don't get it in a lot. But I've never seen it. And it's in one of Hannah's kits. Yeah, do you see what happens there? When Sheila comes in, there's loads of pearls in her kit. When Hannah comes in, she's like, that's a bit special, that's going in. <laughs> what hyperstone? What hyper, there was no hyperstone here. I'm calling it hyperstone now, I don't care what its name is. Now, you've also got, look at this garnet, which I know is a particular favorite of Hannah Roxbury's and mine, January's birthstone. I do like, did you name this kit as well? No, I didn't, she honestly. Did. She did. This is a very Christmassy strand, isn't it? 
I like this. It's making me smile. You get loads. You've got a double strand. The color is awesome. Now, this is going to be a considered purchase, I'm guessing, because you've got the hypersteam, yeah? It's going to be in the 30s. Is it? Okay, so it is. A, it, have we got sterling silver findings? Mm -hmm. Yes, we have. Oh, Hannah. Bathing in a hot bath of gemstone luxury, <laughs> jewels of the night. I have got for you black tourmaline rounds, and I've got red quartz rounds, 10 mil. Tourmaline is 6 mil. You're also going to get all your beading materials, and you know what? You have got sterling silver findings. You are definitely dipping your toe into luxury today. We are talking about that gorgeous heart chain. So this is a considered purchase. You've been asking for sterling silver kits for a while. Maybe if you've been jewelry making for a long time and you're thinking, I, I only create high end. This is a kit for you. Maybe you want to start jewelry making and you want to go in there all guns blazing. You want to get the very best of the very best. This is for you. Don't forget your 30 day money back guarantee with everything that you buy from us here at Jewelry Maker. It's about depth. It's about luxury. It's about creating more expensive high-end pieces out of this kit. Are you ready? It is, a, it is in comparison to the rest of our kits going to be a little bit higher priced than the rest of them but quite rightly so this is for you if you are creating high-end for the jewelry maker that's just gotta have everything cxgc04 jewels of the night for 24 pounds and 95 pence you have got yourself an incredible incredible deal you have got under 30 you said it was going to be in the 30s I, I don't trust you anymore laura Black and red is very sexy, isn't it? And it's a very sexy day, what with Cass and her nails. 24.95. It, you know what? We can create pretty jewelry. We can create jazzy, stylish jewelry. And now we can create quite seductive, quite sexy jewelry. Gorgeous. Now let's go and see. I'm going to take my uh, hyperstone with me and my cup of tea because those are the two things that I just can't do without this morning. <laughs> and I love that you are getting a kit with all of these incredible ingredients. Mm. And don't forget your sterling silver chain. Let's go and check out Hannah's designs now. Hannah, my little love chicken, <laughs> have a look. This is gorgeous. That was an edism, wasn't it? It love was a chicken. Little bit, That's yeah. where that came from. <laughs> let's not say that again. I love this. Very stylish. And again, quite sexy jewellery you've it made is, here. It is. And I think it's all about the black and the red in this kit. I mean, I just wanted to go all out in a big three-strand necklace because we're talking about layering. That's what's, what's in at the moment. Lots and lots of layered chain. But adding detail to it, so at the clasp, we've got little hangers as well, making a feature of the sterling silver chain. It is a bit, I feel like I need to play something a bit jazz <laughs> with this kit, some jazz music, you know, kind of like uh, Frasier, you know? <laughs> yeah. I love Frasier, I'm in love with Niles, which is wrong, I know. Have a look, I know, I don't know what's wrong with me. Have a look, this is gorgeous, it's a plain, stretchy. Yep, Perfect. all you need sometimes. I love it, it is all you need. Love the earrings as well. So you've made lots of little bracelets and earrings and one wow factor necklace. Yeah. It's fab, isn't it? Look at the use of heart chain there with the earrings. So pretty. Jewels of the night. Now, this is very popular. It's our first kit that we've done for the wood solid sterling silver for a long time, mm. actually. So if that's something that you're looking for, this is definitely a kit for you. -hoo. Now, you're going to show us Hannah Lady Oxbury. Mm -hmm. I just have to do these hangers. Now, I've already got one set up. Which part is the hanger? This bit just here is the clasp. It? Yeah. Now, you can make them as long as, and or short as you like. And it is a really, really, really simple technique. So we've taken our beading thread through a hypersthene at the bottom and you'll see you can actually fit Is it like hypersthene is it? Hypersthene, yeah. Is it like hypersthene or not? Sphene, yeah. It's H it, This one's hypersthene. Oh! Hypersthene. Oh, it's hypersthene? Yeah. They've okay. spelt it wrong. That's why I didn't know what it was. <laughs> I, know. I was like, it what wrong. is that? That's how you spell it. No, it's not. It's hypersthene, P-H. Mm. Well, hypersthene. Hypersteam. Hypersteam. 
Yeah. Anyway. <laughs> Back to this. So, <laughs> who do you think is right, Hannah or me? Mm -hmm. Well. Mm -hmm. <sighs> anyway, carry on. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Everyone knows I'm thick. <laughs> okay, so you see the, be the garnets themselves have got a really nice size drill hole because we can fit two lengths of beading thread through them. And what we're going to do is just add one more, you see, lovely size to that through. And we're going to crimp this off using one of our crimp beads. And I always find it's much easier, instead of trying to pull both threads back through, is just use one thread. Now you see I'm putting one thread through part of the chain. Mm -hmm. Did you do that on that one? Yeah, you yeah. did. God, hang on. That, that chain went a very long, I love it. Yeah, I had I a, few, a little length left over as mm -hmm. well. So we're taking one thread back through the crimp. And I like to use my round nose pliers just to hold one thread in place so you can get a really nice, neat circle to it and then crimp it off using your flat nose pliers. To cut the threads I always bend them back against the crimp and using my wire cutting pliers just snip them down, fold it back against the crimp and snip it down. Now the reason I wanted to show this demo was because when the little um, the bead caps arrive, so the crimping covers, mm -hmm. they're closed and to open them Oh, are they? They're normally open. Yeah, they're... they're Hang on a minute. Oh, they're oh, like a bead. Oh, Hannah. I didn't know you could open those. So what you do to open them is put them in the tip of your flat nose pliers. Oh, and oh, gently like Pac-Man. Yeah, and it literally just opens just a tiny little bit. And then you can turn them around in your pliers and use them as you would do any normal crimp cover. Oh, I slip see. Them over, crimp, I didn't know that that's turn. even what they were. There you go. And then Fabulous. you just sort of squeeze them shut and you see I'm sort of moving the pliers around mm -hmm. just to get that seam nice and closed. And that is oh. how you crimp. Now that could be an earring, it yeah, could absolutely. be a charm, it absolutely. could be a handbag charm, it could be anything like that. Mm -hmm. I do like it. Should we try to have a look? Shall I lift it? Sorry darling, sorry my darlings, there we are. Ryan don't know if he's coming or going, do you, Bob? <laughs> there we are. With the heart chain. Oh, I do like this. I do like very popular on the phone lines. My lovely little jewelry makers. Now don't forget, have you do you want me to disclose the answer to the riddle? Has anyone given us the right answer yet? Let's go back. Let's go back and do let's go back. They are twins to each other. What was your answer, Ollie? That's correct, Oliver, you do have the right answer. <laughs> Ollie, you're one of those annoying people that just get everything right. Oh, we used to do. Oh, he knows. Now, let's give you the chain. So I'll tell you all the answer in a minute. Now, have a look at this chain. Now, it's solid sterling silver. And I'm very excited that we've got solid sterling silver chain. It's beautiful, isn't it? It is, isn't it? We have been asked over and over and over again for solid sterling silver chain. And I'm just so pleased we've been able to find a really good source to bring in such a beautiful, beautiful finish to your chain. And of course, if you're talking gems of distinction, um, our cut collection, our collector's choice, you want to be putting it on sterling silver. And what actually Cass has done here looks super elegant, doesn't it? Already just crossing it all over. Mm. Actually, it was longer than that, but I've just pulled it down. Sorry, Cass. Have a look. So this is sterling silver. Is it going to add value to your jewellery? I think so. Well, there's always a value of a precious metal, isn't there? Now you've got five metres. You know when you get kits with us how long one metre goes. Mm -hmm. Five metres is going to go on and on and on. And it is sterling silver. And it is going to make your jewellery maybe... I mean, the perceived value, of course, is going to heighten uh, for your jewellery. And, and maybe it's that you're producing wedding jewellery that you want to last forever. Maybe you're going to give your mum a gift that you want to last forever. Then you would always go with a precious metal. If you're gonna get them organized, any of our very special strands, I've gotta be really quick. This is gonna sell out 34.95 is all you are going to pay today. Q C Q Q. 
Z14, five meters, solid sterling silver chain. Very delicate, very pretty. Look at the sparkle. Where else are you buying your sterling silver chain? Are you having to wait to get scrap pieces? Are you having to wait until one of your necklace pendants, you're fed up with it, and so you take it off? Here's your opportunity, but it does look like we're heading for a sellout on these. Any second now, it's gonna sell out. I will let you know. Now it's time to check out your designs at the Wall of Fame. Oh, it's lovely to see your designs after you, Lady Ox. I've got four top four two two here. Um, it says she's just started making jewellery a few months ago, um, and after going to a jewellery party, and has been hooked ever since. Loves our channel and fantastic deals. She used shell pearl, green magnesite, and fancy agate in her bracelets here, and that's from Kirsty in Whitney. Whitney, that's where um, that's where Mark lives in Whitney. It's a lovely place in the world, Kirsty. Hello, uh, number four two five. Absolutely beautiful, very bright. You know I love my pearls. Now this is a classic, and it's from uh, Antonius Tiaras in York. Now Antonius says, "Hi, jewelry maker. My entry for the Wall of Fame this week. I've designed a tiara using cashew culture pearls, which look like beautiful leaves, and some small four mil white shell pearls. I hope you like it. Completely addicted to the show. Love all the presenters. They are all beautiful. Oh." <laughs> I tell you what, she's watching through those thick lenses again. <laughs> Got to clean your glasses. Uh, Antonia's uh, tiaras in York. Well, it's absolutely beautiful. Thank you so much. Your number four two eight. Now I want this. Oh, I know four two three. It. I think someone's been enjoying our masterclasses. It's from Bev, um, and oh, she says Bev Cake Lady. Oh, send us a cake there. Send us a cake. Um, she said, hi everyone. On Sunday she met Alison before she went to air. Um, and she said she really, really likes the birds she makes. Um, and she says there's only one problem. Everyone in the family would want one for Christmas yeah, this year. I, I think that's about right. Um, she says they're going to have to buy her Debbie's chainmail and Millie Fleury courses in return. I want those birds all over my Christmas tree. I love them. Check this out. Did you buy the sari silk yesterday? Because oh, if you did, beautiful. you'd be very inspired by this. Number 428. Look at the colours. Nesta, I love this. It's a real wow factor piece of jewelry. You can see from there, I mean, this is wow factor. A sunny good morning to everyone from Swansea. Do you know the song about under the Swansea stars? No, no, we'll do that later. Have been trying to think for ages of a way to use up my larger chain. Started making a beaded sari silk necklace the other night, but just didn't like the finished work and was lacking inspiration. And suddenly, woohoo, I spied the chain. Hope you like it. We love it. Have a great weekend. And straight back to you, Nesta. This is fabulous. Well <laughs> done. And I've got 424 here. It says, hi all at JM. This is my entry for this week's Wall of Fame. Tiger's Eye Square to the centre of a Laura binding in inspired gold plate wire bangle love the program designers presenters and crew you're all fun to watch and that's from Roz oh Roz Thank we you love Roz. having your company here today now the chain has it's official just, uh, speaking to my producer well she's speaking to me gone sold out I'm so sorry if you didn't manage to get it today is all about snapping things up as quick as you can we are of course going to give you half an hour of clearance after the break which I know is going to be buzzing busy so make sure you're there phone in hand ready dialing because it's clearance after this Buying jewellery online from us has just become even easier with our new streamlined checkout service. We've made some little changes to make our website more accessible for all of the different ways you shop online and now it's even easier using a mobile phone or tablet. Once you have added your items to your shopping basket, you can decide to check out now or save for later. Saving an item for later means you can easily find them in your own time, but don't forget to check back soon as all our items are selling fast. One of just a few changes that will make buying jewellery from us even easier. You can now keep in touch by liking Jewellery Maker UK on Facebook. Get interactive with Jewellery Maker. Come and join
join guest designer Laura Binding on our intermediate wire work course. The aim of the course is to enhance your wire work skills and take your designs to the next level. You will learn more advanced weaving and binding techniques, which you can incorporate into your jewellery. The full course includes a selection of gauges of wire, a generous scoop of mixed gemstones, a copy of the Wirework Tutorial DVD Edition 3, a buffet style lunch and refreshments, a tour of the studios and chance to meet the presenters, and a visit to our Gemstone Museum. All of this for just £79.95. To book your place, contact our call centre on 0800 644 655. Jewellery Maker, bringing out the designer in you. Add to your collection with our Silver Art Clay DVD full of handy tips and instructions for all levels. Join guest designer Natalia Coleman in her step-by-step -step guide to make this glamorous inner goddess pendant, featuring a variety of different techniques that will help you develop your skills. To get your hands on a copy, phone our call centre on 0800 644 655. Book now to take part in the experience. Take a behind the scenes tour of our TV studios, meet the presenters and learn about gemstones and jewellery. The price of £169 includes an overnight stay at the picturesque White Swan Hotel, a buffet lunch, refreshments and a three course dinner. Dates are limited so call or email us now for an experience you'll never forget. It's time for a good old-fashioned sale and we do love it don't we sometimes people get up some crazy people maybe you uh, I know certainly people that are related to me get up at 5 a.m. for that certain sale probably before that and they're queuing around what is that about you don't need to do that here I'm gonna bring the sale to you you stay there and relax no 5 a.m. start what's that about now my darling jewelry makers let me show you our sale first sale item normally five pounds and 95 pence now you're gonna have to be quick with these because there's very small quantities and everybody's already poised by their phone now these scales talk to me hannah it's about uh resin yeah it's about jewel enamel yeah you can weigh out all of your measurements on there now it's just a simple little click on button you have to obviously put batteries in them and then you can weigh out your resin in the little plastic cups um, you have a tear button on there, as you would do with normal scales. A what button? A tear, so it brings it back to zero once you've put the oh, bowl on top. Is that what that means? <laughs> but you can, you can weigh anything on there, anything you can think of, really. If you're weighing your chain, your silver chain, so you can say in commissions um, how much you, silver you've used weight-wise in a oh. piece. It's really important, actually yes, yeah. because you can say there is certain blah 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 grams of sterling silver yeah. in here. And imagine if you're pricing something up as well to sell, you want to know how much you've used and how much you've put into a piece so you can weigh it that way as well. You're absolutely, back. of course this is very important. Mm -hmm. if, what about if you're doing silver clay, bronze clay, anything like that, you'll want to know the exact weight of the finished item. Now also resin, jewel enamel, normally 5.95. Not today, my little darlings. We are going to give to you clearance deals like this. Are you ready? Be quick, be quick. You don't want to miss this one. If you've got an open basket already, we are not going to charge you any more than one PMP. Today, you get these scales. Now, this is only for today's show. Two pounds and ninety-five pence. If you're trying to shop for this tomorrow, it won't be happening. Two ninety-five. Get me a couple of these. You know how much I love baking. And do you know what? Do you know why these are good for me? Yes, yeah, spices, things like that. Uh, cloves. Ra 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 ra. But you have a one big scale on the go. And, and then if you've got stuff in the scale, like, oh, I can't be bothered to clean that. I need two scales. Perfect. Also, there might be other hobbies you have. It could be, it could be that you've got our gemstone scoops.
and you want to weigh them out see how much you've got in there it could be that you want the exact weight of something or the other two pounds and 95 pence do you know someone's bought four of these maybe you're actually doing tutorials this is a good idea if you're doing tutorials two pounds and 95 pence for some digital scales with the tear button I've just learned what that does wow because uh, my scales are the big old-fashioned ones that go boing boing you know what I mean they're not even digital aren't these you can use them for anything anything you can do whatever you like what about if you're doing a make and take and everybody has got a gram weight of gemstones yeah and you can say you can have whatever but it's it will all this is a good idea you will look professional then won't you mm -hmm. what is it that we is it jewel enamel isn't it where we need to we'll put the powder in yeah and jewel enamel is the powder because you in. need to weigh that don't you you don't necessarily need to wear it, but it does make it... No, it's resin we wear, Resin you wear, yeah. yeah, but if you wanted to make sort of similar pieces over and over again, mm. if you learn how much weight-wise powder goes into a cabochon mould, say, you can always know then. And then, and then wastage is eliminated, yeah. isn't it? £2.95. pence. This is a great deal, and there are lots of you on the phone lines for this. There's a two-minute queue. Don't be put off by that. It is a free phone number, and uh, at the moment... You might be experiencing boop, 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 keep trying, keep trying, keep trying. If you're lucky enough to be on the phone line, stay exactly where you are. Of course, shop online, why not? Jewelrymaker.com. 1 PMP all day long. Now, let's do. What, another clearance deal in box 18? That's not clearance over here, is it? 15, 16, 17, 18. Oh, no, 18, yeah? What, pearls? Clearance pearls? Garnet? What? A brand new... What's this? This isn't Red Spinel. It is, isn't it? It is. It's garnet. The garnet's very red. Look at this garnet. It's beautiful, isn't it? I haven't it? seen this. It's grouped in twos. Have you seen this? You can't do this. This is new. I thought it was Red Spinel. It's very red. Very powerful, isn't it gorgeous? Stem mirror graduated. I love the way they're set into twos. I'd quite like that with a silver crimp bead in between, mm. wouldn't you? This is a very, this isn't, you don't need to clear and steal these, do you? Are they brand new? Are they new? They're not new, says Laura. I don't think they are. She says, don't say that, you're making me feel on edge. Well, have a look. It's not new. It's it's clearance. Look at the size of these rows. I've used these. I've used these for for um for rings before. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Whew. They're lovely surfaces. These would be good wire wrapped, you know. Nice thing, because they've got the edges, they'll be nice slotted together. Oh, and who does not love the, the, the This is what I mean. Oliver just said, the quality of that garnet is amazing. I thought it was red spinel, it's so red. It's very red. Oh, this one's a little bit cheeky. WLG C30. Well, it's Saturday. Let's all be a little bit cheeky. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, 12.95. We like that, we like that. That's crazy. A great big strand of pendants, beautiful garnet. That garnet is luscious. The wheels are two by one to six by three, and we're talking about an eight, a 28 centimetre strand. Your blue peacock pearls are genuine. Wouldn't you pay that for the pearls? What are you doing? You paid that for the garnet. This is we use four of them with the garnet in earrings. Well, Twelve ninety-five would be a good price. This is crazy. Rosa called slabs are thirty-one by twenty-two. It's called pure beauty, and it's an absolute must-have for your stash. Loads of you buzzing around the phone lines. This is a clearance deal. Please don't expect to see it again. It's for today's show only. This deal will not be happening tomorrow. This is a limited offer. Good grief, Penfold. Now. Is this happening, is it? Oh. You're going to want this. Plastic bead boxes. Now, these bead boxes are... They don't have to be for beads, by the way. They can be for anything. 
Oops, they can even be for polymer clay. And you know why they can be for polymer clay? Because we're talking graded plastic. Polymer clay is pesky and it eats things when it's not baked. It's a bit pesky like that. If you put it in any old plastic container, it will ruin it. Now, graded plastic says no polymer clay. You're not eating me. I'm graded. And that's what happens, basically. That's the science of it. Now, that's not, it's not the actual science of it. It's like, it doesn't get, doesn't talk. Uh, now, graded plastic, so it is important, mm -hmm. um, with all jokes aside, it is important. You know what? Have you always dreamed of having your own beadery? A little bit like this. This is Mark Smith's beadery. Good grief. Can you imagine? I bet he's got one of those little handheld hoovers in there. <laughs> I wonder what it smells like in there. He's got a hoover for the hoover. Uh, yeah, I bet he has. This is Klaus. I mean, look, look, look. If you want a beadery like Mark Smith's, he's the neatest man. I bet you open his drawers and everything's perfectly crisp and folded. Not like mine where everything's rummaged around because I can't find the top I want. Now, you have got compartments in every single one of these. Have a look. These are graded plastic. They'll come like this, and you've got your slots. You can, you can do lots of slots, or you can take all of these out if you want. Now, these look great stacked up with all your beads in them. We are going to give you a clearance deal. You get one, two, three, four of them. Do I get four of them? They're normally $6.95 each, aren't they? I know that. So what's $6.95 times four? Just under 28 pounds. Well, over 27, let's say. A tickle under 28. I like saving eight quid. That makes me smile. It is a great deal, 19.95. You know what, you can go on famous auction sites and get these for crazy prices each, can't you? You're buying three and you're gonna get one for free, which is fab. If you want that beadery, if you want your beadery to look like Mark Smith Speedery, or if you've got your own ideas, then this is a deal for you. Put your findings in there, put your chain in there, put your beads in there, put whatever you want in there for $19.95. Don't forget, you have got a 30-day money-back guarantee, even on clearance items. Doesn't happen in the shops, does it? AGGC22 is the item code that you need for this wonderful clearance deal. And again, let me reiterate, any clearance deals that you see are just for today's show. Tomorrow, these deals will no longer exist. Now, my little darlings, we're gonna give you, ooh, doo -doo, doo -doo, doo. oh, I love this bundle. I can't believe these are going, these are my favorite colors. Isn't it funny what goes in the clearance? You know, have you ever bought a dress really expensive only to go into the shops and, and see it half price? You know, sometimes you do get a bargain. And actually, if you go if you go, go in shopping, dress shopping or anything like that at the moment, there are quite good sales on, aren't there? And, and it makes you think, oh, all right, you get value for money. And it's cheeky. You feel cheeky because you've got, you got something for a lot less than, than what people normally pay. Now, for me, this is a heavenly combination. It reminds me of a beautiful garden, and I love these colours together. It reminds me of sunshine with the birds singing, and I love it. Stop a minute. Stop, stop, stop. Come out here, Laura Androlia. Get out here now. How dare you say these? Tell everyone what you've just done, what you've just said. Come on. <coughs> Even Oliver is mad at you. What did you just say? What did you just say to me? What, you want to know what the price is going to be? You, what, why? And is this aquamarine? Yeah. You tell everyone what you've done. Do you want to know the price? You tell everyone it's on camera then and I won't get the blame All for it. All of these are going to be £7.95. Uh, hang on. I've got to put the price out. <laughs> I thought Hannah Oxbury might, <laughs> that was fighting talk. That, you may as well have gone up to Hannah Oxbury in the playground and pushed her over. <laughs> That's exactly what you've just done. And I'm the one going, fight, 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 fight. Get out here and tell her what you just said about her. <laughs> <laughs> Look what she's done. Not for the aquamarine. 
Serpentine carved flowers. Now, can I just say, can I just say, if you were, if you were the person that carved these flowers, <laughs> or don't walk around the street, Laura and Jolia, they now know what your face looks like. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Can you imagine how many hours work goes into each? Strand. I mean, this is insanity. You've also got beautiful rose quartz. This is a great deal. Make sure you grab this with both hands. Get four or five of them. If you make jewellery and you sell it on, you've got to stock up. You've got aquamarine. This is genuine. Any aquamarine for seven ninety five. This blue, I'm going to get about six or seven of them. You also get... Oh, I love this. It's a great deal. You've got to be quick. They are. Uh, we are very, very, very busy on the phone lines. You will be experiencing engaged tones. Please keep trying. You're buzzing around in hyperspace right now. Cyberspace. Cyberspace. Not cyper. Cyberspace. Check out baskets. Lots of you are multi buying. Elaine, you bought three. Well done. Sarah, you're multi buying. Congratulations. Daniela, you've, you're also multi-buying, well done. Amanda, Alison, you're all multi-buying. It's gone, it's sold out. Good grief, Penfold. This kit's not going in clearance. Is that, was that Scott that just came down and said, do what you want, was it? Scott just came down and went, you've got half an hour, do what you want. He's going to regret that. Now, these are, these are ace. I actually went up to Hannah today and went, I love this strand because it reminds me of bananas. Mm. Yeah, I love it. I love it. <coughs> I really like this. Don't you think it looks ace? Or actual lemons. Do you know what they remind me of? Sugar-coated lemons. Aren't these wonderful? I want to bite them, don't bite them. They're like yummy sweeties. We're going to clearance this, Scott said. Oh, are we? Do you know why Scott said that? Because you're down here and he's up there. And he's <laughs> I can't like, do anything about it. <laughs> this was going to be our highest price kit of the day. And you're going to, yeah, but we had our high end kit. Was it going to be higher than that? Crikey O'Reilly. Do you know why though? This is yellow chalcedony, which can be very expensive. Yeah, yellow beryl, yellow chalcedony, yellow fluorite. They, because of the golden tones, they do, and because they're the hardest to get hold of. Aren't these one foot? They do look yummy. It, it has this wonderful sort of cloudy clarity. You're right, and you know what? They do look yummy. They're droplets of. They're very fresh, aren't they? And you've got, oh, I like this. Now, let's add a touch of class. And that's exactly what Smoky Quartz does, isn't it? And then let's add some whites. Ovals, yummy. Then, and I love this, look at this lemon yellow cord. <laughs> Hannah Roxbury, do you mind? <laughs> Do you? It is like a sketch from French and Saunders today with you and Kirsty. <laughs> Do you want me to start? I'll start. <laughs> just making no, stuff. No, go on, go on, it's fine. It's just making me laugh. <laughs> <laughs> Have a look. Don't ever work in a newsroom. Have a look at this lemon yellow cord. Ooh, la la. I love it when we have the coloured beading thread as well. So this was going to be an expensive kit today. You've also got your findings and they're in antique bronze. A meter of chain, you've got your ribbon extenders with the ribbon ends, your eye pins, your head pins. You've got your toggle clasps, so you've got everything you need to make something gorgeous. It's called Flower Maker, TFG. CU7, uh, th <laughs> sorry, Laura's just said something. My producer's just said something crazy. We were gonna launch this at 27.95. Okay, okay, okay. So what is it now? But it's in clearance. You're already offering them a savoring. A savoring, that was the word you were going for. A savoring, not a saving, a savoring. Yeah. 
So Laura has taken £10 off the price tag of this kit because it's clearance woo 17.95 you are getting a treat yellow cow sedney should be this price alone this is a wonderful treat for you let's get on over to lady loud <laughs> lady loud Hi. we're so not going to see a demo we're just going to because okay. hannah's going to be busy later on yet, later with other stuff She's busy making noises today, so we're punishing her by not giving her that. No, we're not really. <laughs> no, Hello, kidding, my kidding. darling. Hello. What's this? What is this? It's a sneaky peek for that. Oh, oh sorry. <laughs> it's a proper tooly looking tool. <laughs> or not? I wasn't supposed to show that, was no. I? Sorry. There you are. So I can do the thicker. Sorry. Yeah. Right, now, <laughs> it's a secret. I'm rubbish with secrets, aren't mm, I? I are. can't. What's the point in them? Unless they're like really serious ones. Isn't this, isn't this elegant? Now, the very low price for this kit, very, very low. Look at it. Now, t talk to me about what's special about Yellow Cow Sydney while Ryan saunters over your gorgeous <laughs> designs. I just think, when it comes to Yellow Cow Sydney, it's just such a happy colour. Yeah, it is. And I think these are going to make beautiful petals if you want to go and make some sort of daisies with them or really pretty feminine designs. It's just, it's just something a bit different. You don't see that strength of yellow in many gemstones. You don't, do you? It's really, really striking. Mm. And I love the lemon yellow cord as well. Very, very popular now. I've just got to let everybody know there are queues on the phone lines, about three, three to four minutes long. It is a free phone number if you're dialing from your UK landline. So please don't panic, but keep trying. We are in clearance, so we're very, very busy. Look at this, 17.95 great price tag 30 day money back guarantee absolute no brainer uh, don't forget checking out baskets definitely a buyers now we are approaching limited on this kit don't forget to send us your designs we love seeing them now you're not we're not having a demo from you we're no. do, what are you doing later then some purse packs probably please some purse packs maybe, maybe. yeah she's yeah. not really she's like maybe 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 now maybe. No, i will um now can we do um, Dremel pumpkins next week, please. Oh, we, we can, we can, we can. I'm not here next week. Where, what do you mean? I'm not here. Where are you? I'm having a holiday. Ho Outrageous, I know. Holiday? I know. First time off since April. Hang on, stop. You're, you're not. What's going to happen? Oh uh, well, who knows? You, you lot can go crazy on prices next week because I'm not here. I'm not sure you you can leave. No, it's not been done before, so we'll see. I'm not sure we can cope. <laughs> I'm not sure what you're going to come back to, if I'm honest. Mm. Well, we can do we can do pumpkins the next week. Holiday? Who does she think she is, Sheila? Come on. <laughs> Where are you going? Just home. Just home. She's just staying at home. Hannah, come <laughs> stay at my house. You can hang out with the pig. No. <laughs> Have a look. Yeah, Hannah likes my pig. Home? Well, go away. At least go and get some sunshine. No. Well, I'm, no, because I'm going to India next week, so we're going buying. Well, I don't need to go to India next week. <laughs> 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 right, well, why aren't I coming with you? Because I don't know. I don't know why you're not coming. I do, because you haven't invited me. <laughs> now, let Clearance. Right, come on. Sorry, sorry, sorry. We've only got 10 minutes of clearance left. Right, we have got your mica powders here. Now, your mica powders are for your... Jewel enamel. Jewel enamel. And you sprinkle them in and they just make everything prettier. Well, can I use them anywhere else? Absolutely. Oh, can I? You can use them polymer clay. Oh, how? Just rub them onto polymer clay before it's baked and it will take up to the, the raised surfaces so it gives you much more de definition. Oh. And also, you can mix them with water and make paint. What's the difference between this and Gleam, then? You can paint with it. Yep, you can paint with it. The Gleam is more of like a, a buff powder. It gives much more of a shine, whereas this gives like a very light surface colour. Oh, I like the idea. But it stays, it stays, mm -hmm. yeah? Yeah, you yeah? can um, wax over it afterwards. OK, so you can you also paint with mica powder. Lovely colours. Zesty orange. You've also got silver. You've also got soft pink. Oh, that's nice. Dusky blue. Yellow, yellow. That looks gold to me. It's gold, isn't it? Oh, it's, what's this? The sticker's over the, the sticker's over it. Here, this is, well, it's red, isn't it? 
So you got your red. <laughs> it's because they always called something fancy, like zesty orange, dusky blue, soft pink. Now all of this should cost you over twenty pounds, twenty-one pounds, almost. But not today, my little clearance beauties. We're going to give you a fabulous price tag this is a humongous saving ujgc 37 for your mica powders if you are into your jewel enamel resin you could sprinkle it into resin polymer clay says hannah should be hang on a minute should be 21 quid 12.90 we're lack of the price because scott said do what you want Oh, that's dangerous. Dangerous words for Laura, the producer. 0800 644 is the way to get involved on those phone lines. Literally what we like. All the W's, dot jewelry. That's the worst thing to say to a girl, isn't it? Do what you like. Really? £12.90. Woohoo! Now, luckily, you're tuned into us, and we do like to be a little bit mischievous. So let's do something a little bit mischievous, shall we? Shall we? I'm going to give you something now that you don't just want, you need. We don't normally give you massive clearance. De well, not clearance. We give them you on good bundle deals. Clearance deals on finance because you need them. You absolutely need them. We're in constant um, cycle of them. We're having to buy them, buy them, buy them, buy them, buy them. So, you know, we don't need to put these in the clearance because you would, there's always going to be a demand for them. We just love you. We just love you. So, have a look. Sometimes we just do things because of that. I'm going to give you just loads and loads of eye pins. You need them, don't you? You need them for anything beyond a stretcher. You need findings like this. Absolutely wonderful because you have got solid sterling silver with a nine karat gold overlay really important to use certain precious metals with certain fine with certain gemstones isn't it because you want them to hold their value because you want them to be more special and hg c56 is your item code look at all of these you have got 80 80 of them now you would normally pay just having a look for you where is it where is it where is it You would normally pay just a tickle under 24 quid. Quid, am I allowed to use that word? Pounds. Now, we're gonna give you a bit of a clearance cheeky one. Not 24 pounds today. We're gonna give you a clearance deal that means you're getting a great, whoa. 14.95 they're solid sterling silver they're nine karat gold and they are a must-have this is an essential for your stash you don't just want them you need them to jewelry make with you cannot do much now there are lots and lots of you buzzing around the phone lines again you're loving the clearance this is a crazy sale you are literally going crazy we've only got five minutes left so let's give to you should we do something really cheeky? Because Cops said we could do what we like. Yeah, let's do it. All right, okay. Do what you like. Was that, was that E17 you were just singing to me? Oh, let's take that. Oh, that's how you rolled, is it, right? right that's all right then. I love D17, just to annoy my mum because they were the bad ones. Can't you like take that, like all the good girls? No, I'm in love with Brian Harvey even though he looks like a rodent. Have a look. <laughs> Have a look. Oh, hang on a minute, what are you doing? Oh, this is cheeky. Is this what I think it is? Is this pink amethyst? It is, isn't it? Oh my word, oh my word. Look at that. Look at the color, isn't it pretty? Oh, I love, I love Rose de France Amethyst though. It's a massive favorite of mine, isn't this beautiful? Shell Pearl. Now, to, this is a very, very expensive looking bundle. Are you gonna do something really, let's do something really cheeky. Yeah, go on, go on, because we're allowed. You've got your white pearls, bit of a silver edge and they're six mil. 
And there's a shell pearl. It's all about the pink amethyst. This is super bridal. Super. It's very pink. This. Well, it's pink amethyst. That's why. This is the best pink amethyst I've seen. The pinkest pink amethyst, anyway, if that makes sense. Are you ready? What? Okay, so this should be... What should it be? Should be almost £30. Oh, that's not bad. It's not £30. Oh, Hannah. Oh, that's not right, surely. <laughs> well, no one can get hold of the buyer and apparently she's going on holiday next week and then to <laughs> India. So Laura thought, what else? What's she going to do? <laughs> well, she can't catch me from India. FQC, uh, 75 is your item code. It is called Pure Elegance, darlings. Uh, this is going to sell out any minute now. That's 3.30 a strand, it's ridiculously low. One last recap on the scales for you. What did I do with them? Oh dear. Oh, I put them away, that's not like me. Now, have a look. Did you do it, Cass? Did you put them away for, oh, I must have done it naturally. Oh yes, I'm changing. <laughs> oh yes, yes, yes. <laughs> I actually do feel really proud of myself. <laughs> I naturally tidied up after myself, which doesn't... I'm like somebody who walks in a straight line with all this disaster going on behind me, I just don't even notice where I've done something. Oh, dear. Anyway, have a look. You've got your scales. We went really low on these, didn't we? We went really low on these. Mm. I thought we weren't supposed to go this low for anything. Mm. It's the same as that PMP, isn't it? Ollie, Ollie just said something. Yeah, it's the same as our PMP. <laughs> Shouldn't do those faces, should I? She's crazy. What can we say? The girl's crazy. I don't know what she's doing. It's clearance. We love it. Two ninety-five. I'll have some of that. Maybe I'll have two or three of them. The price of your PMP. Two ninety-five. Just crazy. We love, love, love you. You know what? Please don't forget us with the Wall of Fame. Please don't forget. Oh, by the way, the answer to the riddle is they're both 20. One's 20 and one's 22. She's 20 as well. Like, she's 22. Do you get it? Sorry. It's time for the Wall of Fame. <laughs> We're like the uh, thingies, <laughs> what are they called? Charlie's Angels then. There was a little bit of dancing going on, wasn't there? <laughs> that's yes, that's what we're like. The, we're exactly like the Charlie. We're nothing, nothing, not really not like that, are we? So much. Now, why? We've we got the lovely lady binding next door. This that's is gorgeous. Nice. Yeah. Isn't it lovely? Is it a necklace? Let's have a look. Number 429, very intricate. I love the colours. I bet you love the, that deal we just did, the 7.95 crazy deal. Uh, Michelle of Indigo Berry uh, says, Hi all, I haven't sent in one for a while, but decided this morning to share this picture of my smoky quartz and sunstone bib necklace. That is gorgeous. Mm. Isn't it lush? Um, now, um, do, do, do cross fingers for the draw on Wednesday. There you go. Uh, I've been having trouble watching JMO after, over the last months. I know I've been on a lot, I'm sorry. Uh, we used to get it okay, but now it keeps, oh, I think there's an issue with your, with your people that provide, I'm not sure. So anyway, she's saying she's got a slow broadband where she is and she's missing us. We miss you too. Uh, best wishes to all at JM uh, from Michelle. Thank you, Michelle. This is absolutely lovely from Indigo Berry. Gorgeous. Look how oh, beautiful that makes this has been photographed. Smile. That's really pretty. Oh, I love a flower. Number 427 says, Hi, I've just um, had some leather cord from JM for over a year and she didn't know what to do with it oh. uh, until she saw Mark's bracelet yesterday mm -hmm. and realised the answer. Um, he called it a ladder weave and knotted the leather to make the clasp. Um, it goes so well with Mookite rondelles and she's really pleased with, with the results and that's June in Carlisle. Oh, that gorgeous. is gorgeous. It is, I love Mookite as well, it's so warm, isn't it? Oh, 
Love a bit of green and gold together. This is Perfect. very Christmassy mm. indeed, and it's making me smile. Number 430 is from Stephanie in Cornwall, and she says, Here's my entry to this week's Wall of Fame. I love Cornwall. Um, two bracelets I've made using big green beads from Bead Scoop, which I think are quartzite. Uh, some green jade uh, from her very first kit, and one I've used some serpentine. Gold wire to make cage beads in the bracelet on the right, and the one on the left, I've threaded the beads onto one mil wire, then wrapped 0.6 over the beads uh, to make more of a bangle. I made the clasp from wire too. Uh, loving the shows and the demonstrations as always. Love from Stephanie in Cornwall. Lovely, Stephanie and Cornwall. Cool. Love right back to you. It's gorgeous. Number four thirty. Love that. And we've got forty eight. A Ooh. beautiful wire ring. Yes. And it says, "Hi, Joe and family. This is my second entry to the Wall of Fame, and my first real attempt at wire work." What? <laughs> That's crazy, what? isn't it? No. She used the mask class and was amazed how easy it was to follow. She made this garnet ring in using faceted beads and gold wire from JM and a few quartz beads from her stash. Decided to treat herself to some new JM tools the other day and can't Ooh. wait to get her hands on them. Oh, I wonder if it was the zebra ones. Oh, yeah, they were nice, they were. And that's Donna in Broxburn. Let's see it like that. Broxburn. Look at this. I love the photography. Oh. It's very Egypt. I feel like I'm in Egypt. Mm, it's beautiful. That Ancient is really Egypt. nice. It's gorgeous. I love rosary too. Mm. Can I have a look? At 431. It's from Una in Newcastle. I love Una's designs actually. Mm. Um, hi JM. My entry for this week's Wall of Fame is a necklace I've made with soda light and gold wire. Hope you like it. I've also finished these vases. What? <gasps> she no. did the vases out of polymer clay. Wow. And, and candle jars. Oh. That's amazing. I love Una. Una, you're brill. This is wonderful. Ryan, quote Ryan. Amaze balls. Amaze balls, definitely. Amaze -balls. Totes, amaze balls. This is wonderful. Now, the 295 that you see on your screen is for the scales. If you want those, they're only 295 in the clearance. Now, clearance is now over. We're going to continue with that gorgeous rainbow moonstone. We've got loads of lushness in today's show. So make sure you tune in after this. Buying jewellery online from us has just become even easier with our new streamlined checkout service. We've made some little changes to make our website more accessible for all of the different ways you shop online, and now it's even easier using a mobile phone or tablet. Once you have added your items to your shopping basket, you can decide to check out now or save for later. Saving an item for later means you can easily find them in your own time, but don't forget to check back soon as all our items are selling fast. One of just a few changes that will make buying jewellery from us even easier. Book now to take part in the experience. Take a behind the scenes tour of our TV studios, meet the presenters and learn about gemstones and jewellery. The price of £169 includes an overnight stay at the picturesque White Swan Hotel, a buffet lunch, refreshments and a three-course dinner. Dates are limited, so call or email us now for an experience you'll never forget. You can now watch clips from Jewellery Maker on our YouTube channel. Get interactive with Jewellery Maker. Moonstone is beautiful. It looks so stunning in bridal jewellery. Its iridescence just makes it such a different gemstone against anything else. When you're putting it into your own jewellery, you can put it in tiaras, you can put it in drop earrings, and it makes those pieces special. One of the most fascinating things about Moonstone is, I think, it's myth and legend. And whether it's a gemstone which is used for fertility or a gemstone which you give to loved ones, it's a fantastic gemstone to own, especially from JM, because of the natural qualities, the rainbow shilly which you get from this amazing gem. And whether it's in nuggets or whether it's really, really highly faceted, whether it's a smaller carat weight or a larger carat weight, you're always guaranteed a superb example of the gem. Moonstone, 
this particular moonstone is extremely special because we are talking about not only the iridescence, not only the normal magic that we wish for and hope for in any moonstone stand, but also a strand that boasts utter clarity. Now we don't see that often. This is of course the Gems of Distinction strand. When was the last time you saw a striking strand that offers such wonderful hues of blue with such clear clarity? Because we don't normally see that, we normally see cloudy, which is beautiful, but this really should be put on a pedestal. Now have a look. Have a look. Just beautiful. I want you to think about tiaras. I want you to think about putting this in earrings. I want you to think about giving this some movement. Now this is going to be a considered purchase and it is compared to a lot of our moonstone but there's a reason. This is the creme de la creme of rainbow moonstone. If we graded moonstone, this would be right up there with a triple A or a quad A grade. It would be some of our finest ever moonstone. You can see that the shiller is very, very striking. A lot of blue here. Can you see why people associate magic and hope with genuine gemstones? Can you see why there is, whether you believe it or not, whether you believe it or not, that there is a sentiment attached to this wonderfully magical looking gemstone like fairy wings the delicate delicate beauty that this strand offers is going to reflect in the jewelry that you create with it and whatever it is whether it's a tiara whether it just one of these is in a pendant it's going to be striking and it's going to do it in a very subtle way. See that clarity? See that blue? Absolutely stunning. Hannah Oxbury, tell me, what makes this strand so different to a lot of other beautiful, mm -hmm. don't get me wrong, so all strands of Moonstone to me are beautiful, what makes it, what sets this one apart? Well, first and foremost, it is the clarity. The clarity of this strand is just immense. You can see all the way through the strand, but you're also getting that beautiful shiller across the surface of the stone as well, mm -hmm. which I think is amazing. Usually you only see quite high shiller off more opaque stones because you've got more of background to them. Yes, yes. But this just highlights it. It's, it's just stunning. Absolutely stunning. So to see a strand with clarity mm. rather than a stone, a stone that's got more cloudiness to it, actually to get a stronger shiller is a real rarity. Yeah, because usually if you've got quite a clear stone, um, the shiller is almost diluted because you've got obviously your skin tone behind it or whatever you're putting it against behind the stone itself, which can detract. So this is very expensive expensive yeah. moonstone yes this is jewelers quality moonstone yeah the kind of moonstone you'd see at tiffany's and cartier oh, have you seen jean schlumberger's um jellyfish with moonstone yes. in it in yes oh, oh my, my goodness. gosh it's thousands of pounds this is the kind of quality that you would see in jewelers yeah unbelievably beautiful this rainbow moonstone is for the connoisseur. This rainbow moonstone is for you if you want the very best, if you, if you are creating extremely high-end pieces. This is the strand that you want. It is going to be more expensive than most of our moonstone piece um, strands, but it is much more exclusive. DFJ. N38 is your item code with a 30 day money back guarantee. If you are creating bridal pieces that you want to stand out from the rest of the bridal jewelers, this is your strand at 20, 
You were 90, you weren't going under 20 pounds. No, fine, 1995 is your price. I had argued with you. 1995, it is still more of a considered purchase. We have seen Moonstone at 12.95, we have. But this is, this is a real, this is royalty. And there is so much myth and legend behind Moonstone. Fertility. It is magical, right, it's like magic, it is. And I, you know, you know me, I am the most superstitious person. And it doesn't matter if you're sat there and, you, and you're like, I don't go for all that superstition stuff. I don't go all for that myth and legend stuff. Well, if you're creating jewelry to sell, I bet you at least one of your customers is superstitious and does really love something with a meaning. That's why I love genuine gemstones, you see, because they have meaning behind them. And I believe them, I do, I don't mind if I admit it myself. Everybody, each to their own and all of that lot, but I do like a bit of magic. I do like, I do like that. You know what I'm like, Hannah, I predict your life before you know about it. <laughs> you do? I like things like this. This is a really pretty, a really, pretty strand and, and you must get it if you if you like me are drawn to things that you think are a bit magic then this is the strand for you well done to everybody that has got it 1995 we're approaching limited really busy today now i have got the wire twister tool and it's back in stock now you need to be quick with this i will tell you we are all missing out Gemma crow says she can't live without it Debbie Balfour, can't, you can't live without Linda it, Linda loves it. Linda loves well. it. I love it too. <laughs> Have it, I'm opening it. Tell her to come and get me, I don't care. Now, is that note still there? Please stop opening the samples from Ed. Come and make me stop. Now, I'm going to give you the wire twister tool. Now, Hannah, you have to undo this when you first get it. That's true, isn't it? Yes and you pop. So these little washers are annoying, aren't they? Now, you've, I'm going to leave the washers out, actually. What are you doing? Oh, hurry right, up, I've just dropped it. Wait there. Oh, oh this is why Ed doesn't like it when I open stuff. Now, <laughs> now, the wire twister tool, you know what it does. Hannah, can I just see some twisted wires so I can show everybody what they do? Now you put your wire underneath, you screw it on, and you literally, this is so easy peasy, lemon squeezy. What density, what gauge wire can I twist up to? Well, that's 0.6, that one. Is that the thickest I can go? I go 0 0.8 though. I could go one mil on this, can't I? You can try it, yeah. We've got more heavy duty ones as well, but. Or are you better off just going up to 0 0.6? Probably, yeah, just to be safe with it. So you do this. And then you get this. You, all you've got to do is twist, look, I love it. I know. That is a great piece of jewelry you're gonna create. Out of now it's probably, Hannah, would you agree this has been our most popular tool so far this year? Definitely, yeah. We've had to order this in and order it in and order it in again. It flies out every time it's on air. And quite rightly so, because it, it really gives a different medium and different texture to your pieces as well. It makes a massive difference and you can do it with ease. Now, yeah. I haven't been able to get hold of mine. I've had to use yours that's in here. <laughs> I know everybody who's working with wire is obsessed with this tool. Easy, fun, and it's effective. ERBN53 is your item code, the wire twister tool is 845 now a lot of the time we give it to you in a bundle so many of you said i want the wire twister tool i want it on its own i want it now you need to hop on the phone lines because this one will sell out again it does every single time sarah elvin she's one who can't live without it as well 845 there is a queue on the phone lines forming again have you got an open basket have you already got your wire twister tool and you love it so much you want two or three then grab this maybe you want your best friend to have one too you cannot rave enough about this it's the probably the product with the very best reviews this year isn't it eight pounds 45 pence an absolute steal for under a tenner when you realize what it does if you haven't got it you need it where have you been it's in stock and it's in stock now so grab it while you can wonderful to have your company here today it's saturday it's saturday you can relax 
You don't even have to get out your dressing gown if you don't want to. Eight pounds, 45 pence. I do love a dressing gown, do you? You can, you can wire twister in your dressing gown. Life should all be done in dressing there. By the way, we've got a new tool as well, which is like a wire twister, but for thicker wire. That is very exciting. <laughs> it's about doing the twist today. Ollie's gonna do the twist for you in a minute, aren't you, Ollie? Like we did last summer, you know? Mm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, like the one we did last summer. He's, out, he's got, a, got a sherbet lemon in his mouth, so he can't talk. <laughs> mm. Oh, you were just doing that face. No, you weren't. You have got a sherbet no, lemon. Yeah. Where have you pulled sherbet lemon? <laughs> because it, anyone who makes that face can only have a sherbet lemon in their mouth. This is my face. <laughs> well, that's, your, that's not your sherbet lemon first. Other sweets are available. We've just had a phone call. Tell her other sweets are available. Right. Now, they're very, very, very limited on this. And it sounds like we're limited in the sherbet lemon department as well. Now, Hannah has got the new tool. We are very excited about it. People are asking, Laura's on the phone now, saying it's coming up soon. So somebody's obviously rang in and asked, when's the new tool? It's coming up soon, don't worry. We're gonna give it to you. Don't worry, just be patient. Maybe they've got to go out. They might do. They might have to go out. To stay in a way. Especially if they've got kids, Saturdays are busy. Mm. There's no such thing as a lion. That's why you should have cats now. Let's do. Not really. Not really. We're glad that we've got to get up at the crack of dawn every day. My daughter was washing a pony at 5.30 this morning. What's that about? That's dedication for you, that is. Now, I've got for you 0 0.6 wire. Have a look. 0 0.6 is great for earring findings and I love antique bronze. Oh my gosh, it's so perfect with the copper wire. Wire twister, love it. It looks amazing, it's so Bulgari, darlings. 0 0.6 is great for the weaving in and out of things that you want to keep a structure of. So you've got something big, but you want, you want it because you can manipulate it a little bit. Basket weave is good. I'm interested in making a basket weave bangle. That's my next thing. Yeah. Just a regular old weave that I learned at school. Yeah, you do that, I think. I'm going to do it. I love weaving. Yeah. Weaving is quite therapeutic. So you can do that with this. You can, weaving is good. Weaving is good for you. I'm going to, we're all excited in my house about doing the Harvest Festival baskets. Oh my gosh, I could, or oh, Hannah could make me a while work. <laughs> I mean, you're going to be on holiday. Uh, yeah. And let's yeah. face it, you're going to be bored. <laughs> I'd like a wire work basket, please, for my harvest festival. I'll see what I can manage. Thank you, if you would. <laughs> so if you want a wire twist at all, you can do it with this wire. I love this colour. It's so vintage. Do you love steampunk? I love it. Do you love steampunk, Hannah? Mm -hmm. I oh, make loads in Colin McClay for steampunk. I love it. Yeah. And this I can't is get enough of colour. It. I hope it never goes out of style. <laughs> and even if it does, I'm going to do it anyway. Yeah, why not? Have a look. If you want to create something beautiful out of wire, Oliver has just very kindly put next to me something that's been made, in fact, out of copper and antique bronze wire together by the uber-talented Lady Crow. Now, if you want some inspiration from any of our designers, Gemma Crow is wonderful, Rachel Norris, Inspiration City, Karen Crawford, fabulous, and of course, who can forget, our new Alison, who I am dying to meet because she made those birds and I want one. Now, if you, in fact, I'm gonna get those birds. I'm not mentioning Laura, she's, I give her too much of a big head. No, not really, I love Laura, she's amazing. She's doing a wire work course right now. Do you know, Laura is such a lovely, lovely, sweet person. Actually, I'm gonna get some of her workout. Where is it? Where's all the binding pieces? There's one. That's a binding, isn't it? She is literally amazing at pendants. That's a Norris. Here we go. Laura Binding does these. What Laura does is really intricate, actually, isn't it? She does an awful lot of weaving to her designs, which just look incredible. Have a look at this. Hannah's all right at wire too, aren't you, darling? Not that, not like that, no. <laughs> I mean, this is amazing. Look, look how neat she is. Laura's amazing. Look at that, who's good at sewing? Oh, she's not sewing, she's filing. Ryan went, she's good at filing. Soaring. Oh. Soaring a lot loudly in the That's studio. That's all right, you carry on. I'm very excited to see what you're gonna come up with. Now, I'm not gonna disturb her. If you want to do that detailed work, 
In fact, maybe you're sat there and you're thinking to yourself, what shall I, how do I progress in my wire work? Come into one of Laura's courses. If you look now, she's got a wire work course going on right now. There's a lot, there's 13 people in there. We're gonna give you a great deal. This deal should be, these should be 45 pounds. There's 100 meters on each. $32.95, whenever we give you wire deals, they absolutely rock it. You love wire. Get one of our DVDs, $4.95, right from the beginners. You could be doing wire work projects. You could be coming in on a course. There is so many of you on the phone lines for this. Please bear with the cues. It's a great deal, £32, 95 pence. This is probably one of our most popular colors in wire. I just think you can't jewelry make to your best ability. To, you can't push yourself to the very, very last without using wire in your designs. Wire is a very important addition to your collection, I think. LSGC46 is your item code. The Wire Twister Essentials, 0.8 and 0.6. Antique bronze. Oh, you've got 0.8 and 0.6. I've got two 0.6s here. 0.6 and 0.8, I've got the wrong ones. I see, I'm sorry. Uh, don't forget you can make shepherd's hooks with 0.6. 0.8 is great for structure, isn't it? Look at that, who did that? Gemma Crow, wowzers. Wowzers. Please come in on Laura's um, wire work course as well because you will love it. And she makes great cuppers and gives good cuddles. And I don't even like cuddling. No. I don't. Ollie's coming with. Oh, what you got, Oles? Oh my gosh, who did that? Wow. Oh, that's Karen Crawford. Oh, she's amazing, isn't she? Mm. Crikey, why is this in a box? That's not breakdown, is it, Oliver? No. Good. Oh, hang on, I got it the wrong way around. This is amazing. Come on. Have you seen this? With the twister. Oh, my word. Oh, I've got a wonky thing. I've got it wonky. There we go. There we go. It's because it needed manipulating around. Look. <gasps> she is, isn't she wonderful, Karen Crawford? I'm a gobsmacked. She's brilliant. Like, literally. When's Karen on next? Does anyone know? Do you know Lady Ox? No, I'm afraid. I love this. Who told you that? Karen's on a Monday. The phone just went really loud, made me. J oh, it's, it's McBotty. It was actually Karen on the back phone. <laughs> Scott on the back phone now. Hannah's got a bat phone. It's red, yeah, it just goes nee. When we do something wrong, the, the cat phone goes off. <laughs> it is called the cat phone. It's when it's me. She's yeah. crazy cat lady. Oh, no, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you know, like she's the girl um, on Facebook that updates her status about her cats at least 25 times a day. Oh, that's, that's nowhere near, it's at least 50. Surely. They are cute cats though. They're they naughty. Are. are they? Yeah. You do that with your dog, do you, Rye? What kind of dog have you got? A collie, haven't you? Labradoodle! Not a Labradoodle. A Labrador mix. Now, let's give to you. Can I just say something really freaky happened to me yesterday? Like, I, you know, I had quite a few, I was telling everybody at work, I had quite a few different incidents after I got back from work yesterday. One being that my dog that I had when, as a child, my mum bought it for me for Christmas when I was 11. She told me to go and get the washing out of the car and there was a puppy there, this big. I was like, <gasps> it was a Tibetan terrier, Emmy, I called her. And um, when I pulled in, she died about, she went on for ages. I was 11 and uh, Mia, was, Mia was around and Mia played a recorder at her funeral. I reckon Mia was about four or five. So she really lasted a long time. Anyway, when I got back to my drive last night, there my dog was, my dead dog on my driveway. I was like, oh, I'm going really mad. I'm going mad. Anyway, no, it wasn't. It wasn't Emmy. Thank God I wasn't going mad. But I now live in Hertfordshire. I lived in Cheltenham before. It was the same breeder. No. The exact, she looked, I'm telling you, with, my, with the exact replica of my dog. How weird is that? 
They were related. They had the same pedigree name apart from what they were from the same breeder. They were the same mix. Really weird, wasn't it? And I was like, <gasps> I rang my mum and went, Emmy was on my driveway. She's like, oh God, listen, I can't deal with your craziness now. I'm in the middle of something. I was like, no, it's true. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the people in my life love me. Anyway, and there was a man trying to sell me live chickens. That doesn't happen, does it? Let's do the acrylic bundle before it, oh, I start making everyone's brains hurt. Now, oh, oh, I'm gonna take the sheeting off here, if I may. No, I'm not doing that one, everyone to see what they're getting. I did that last time and about four people Facebooked me and said, we couldn't see what we were getting, so I'm gonna undo it. They couldn't see because it was too skinny. I know, Ryan. Ryan. <laughs> Ryan's not moaning again. <laughs> yes, he is. Have a look. So you've got the blue. You can't see the colours on it. I did that before. Everybody didn't like it. I had four emails now. So I'm going to undo it now. Well, I'm going to get... I'll show you. I'll get Cass to undo one side while I show you everything else. Now... Now, I'm going to show you, we have got the 12 piece needle file. Now, the different needles are going to give you different looks, which Hannah's going to talk you through in a little bit. Now, you've also got here, Hannah, these are the um, saw blades, aren't they? And you get yep. loads of loads in there. Nice and nice. then you've got your saw. Now, this is a great little kit, and I'm going to show you what you can create. I've got Hannah's necklace that I've stolen this morning on the chair, which I'm going to get in a minute. Now, you've got your anvil which looks like ooh, this like the way it's so you've got your anvil and it's got the wooden block it comes with it now hannah mm -hmm. having tried to purchase an anvil before i noticed that mine did not come with a wooden block no usually they are sold separately but obviously for ease we put them together that's better. Mm -hmm. I don't want to buy it separately. I want to buy it all in one. So you've got the wooden block there as well. Oh, we are going to talk you through all of this, what it does, how it works. There are tutorials online. We're going to give you a fantastic deal on your acrylic starter kit. Now, if you want to create some in your face designs, it's acrylic that you need. If you want to make your own templates, if you want to make your jewelry stand out, if you want to make repeat designs maybe you've got a particular interest in in covering certain hobbies things like that it could be cats it could be anything have a look what hannah's created and this is what you i will show you your acrylic sheets in just a sec look at that you get all of your acrylic sheets you get to, all for 34.95 you've got your german style saw and we do know anything like cars anything like that germans just are great at making things aren't they mm -hmm. that last and built to last have a look you can create this it's the birds that hannah's created i'm going to show you the acrylic sheets that you get in just a tickle i love this have a look Here's everything you get. You do get the acrylic. I'm going to show you the proper colours in just a, a, a second. But if you want to start creating more stylish wow factor pieces, then this is most certainly for you. I'm talking about edgy pieces. I'm talking about maybe you want to create your own sign for your craft stall. Mm -hmm. I'm talking about adding colour and design. Now, if you're not sure how to do this, don't worry, because Hannah is, of course, here to show you exactly how. Now, Hannah, it is about making those wow factor pieces, yeah. and it is also about, I think, standing out from the crowd acrylic, isn't Absolutely. it? Absolutely. It's all about statement pieces bright bold color and just having a bit of fun with your jewelry making designs as well I do think Hannah this is very funky and fresh and it does look like something you would see out there done by a very famous designer yeah I love the block colors here very mm -hmm. pop art but yeah. that's gonna be really popular isn't it uh, with your customers I do think things things like this that, that really set you apart from other jewelry makers yeah definitely it's all about being unique I mean at the moment we're seeing a sharp increase on boutique stocking acrylic and perspex jewelry um, because it is all about that more unique twist to your designs mm -hmm. um, and of course you know you've got big designers out there like the likes of Tati Divine which have just gone oh viral. Tati Divine 
and it is just quirky, fun, unique jewellery, but you can add in as component parts or as a four piece like the patchwork perspex to the end. I there love as well. that and I love the macrame you've done. Is it macrame you've done? Uh, Kamihimo. Look at the colours. I love your use of Kumahimo colours on there. The earrings are so cool, aren't they? They're very Andy Warhol. They are. Just really sort of 90s pop culture, aren't they? I love that. <laughs> $34.95. I'm going to show you the acrylic. I just want to show you. You can also keep it classic. Doesn't have to all be in your face brightness. Have we got a, um, have you got a white bus so that I can show everybody? Big. I just wanted to be able to show everybody the she got. Look, you can keep it classic as well. Is it all right on me hand, is it right? Ray says, yeah, it's not we really can see on your hand, hand. do panic. I'm just gonna show you the colors that you get in your acrylic. You get the blue. You get the black. You get the yellow. I'll talk to Hannah in a bit how, how we can expect this to last. You get the thunder cloud gray. <laughs> you get the white, white. And you get the red. Now, Hannah, how many projects can we get out of each one? You can you can go to town. I mean, the patchwork um, perspex necklace there is actually made and started life from scrap pieces. So I've cut out say a shape, and I've got odd edges and things yeah. to use up. So literally, cut them off, file them down, and start linking them together a bit like a jigsaw. You can obviously plan it in advance. Or you can let it form organically as well. But I like it. I like the latter. Yeah. Let it form <laughs> organically. Let it happen. And you can literally just fit shapes into one another using your Dremel, drill holes through the perspex, and attach your jump rings as well. Do I absolutely have to have a Dremel? You don't absolutely have to have one, but it does take your acrylic to the next level if you do. Okay, so to start with, I might get the basics, and yep. then, I mean, I think you need the Dremel in your life for a million yep. different reasons, if not just for pumpkin decorating, <laughs> but also for a lot of other projects. Look at that. <laughs> that is wonderful, isn't it? So, Hannah, you're going to give us a demonstration. Uh, tell me exactly what you're going to do. Well, I haven't got, um, obviously, the full workbench set up because we're in a television studio, so it's a bit difficult to work on. But what you would have is your bench peg and anvil combination block set up on your workbench, and that gives you a really nice flat surface from which to work from. Now, obviously, this is part of the red acrylic sheet, and you see I've sectioned a couple of little triangles off mm -hmm. just with marker pen. What you can also do is print offline if you've got images, silhouettes and things that you like the shape of. You can print those off, cut round them with scissors and stick them to the top of the perspex to use them as a, as a guide, as a template if you will. You can obviously grab our saw blade, that's already set up with one of the uh, 1.0 um, saw blades to it and it's literally just a case of getting stuck in. I'm holding the perspex flat. Obviously, this would be my bench peg if I had it. Okay, so you won't need to do that at home because you've got your bench peg. Yeah, you'd have it all set up on there. Okay, dopes. And so initially, you just want to run the saw blade down the side to create either little nick. Mm -hmm. If you do find that's quite difficult, you can use your um, needle files to create a little indentation. Okay, so you and just once you've got in. the nick, then you're in, aren't yeah, you? Yeah, then you're in. <laughs> And it's just a case of cutting. Now, I'm not putting any pressure on that. No, it actually is a bit like butter, isn't it? It is really, really easy to cut. And you see, I'm keeping the saw straight rather than tipping it forward or bending it under. Because yeah, I'd be inclined to want to put it at an angle. No, it cuts much better. It's set up to cut with the saw straight. If you tip it, you can run the risk of bending and eventually snapping your saw blades. And uh, we just get to the end there. Trim that off. There we go. Ooh, and drop it on the floor. But that then creates obviously little triangles that you can use in your designs. Now from this point, you can drill them and you can file the edges with your needle files just to smooth them off as well. So you get a really nice finish to them also. Hannah, if I haven't got the Dremel, how else can I drill a drill hole in? Um, with a you, regular? Yeah, with a, with a normal windy, windy uh, manual drill, if you like. Um, but you can also, you don't have to use them as drilled pieces. You can wire wrap them if you so wish um, and treat them more like a cabochon to create really interesting wire wrap designs. 
Um, that's, a, that's, that's, that's good actually. Yeah, you could watch us wire wrap them, yep, couldn't you? Absolutely. So you're just puzzling together, yep. putting them, putting Completely the uh, right. drill holes in. Now I can show you how, how to drill it. So we've got um, the Dremel set up. This is the second to smallest um, drill bit, which is the perfect size for the, our smaller jump rings that we have here. And I've already tightened it in place using the blue lock button, tightened it round so it's all safe and ready and set up to use. I've obviously got my glasses on, so I'm fully health and safety done. <laughs> um, and I use it on a low speed. <laughs> and I literally just bring it in. You see, I've kept the covering on the perspex because if I slip with my drill, it's not <laughs> if I slip with my drill, it's not gonna, it's not gonna affect the piece. I'll choose one side and gently through and again I'm steaming up <laughs> you see how easy that was to drill and that's created just a really 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 neat drill hole to your piece as well from that that point, was easy I love the Dremel <laughs> from that point just grabbing one of your jump rings now I always open and close jump rings with two pliers because it gives you a lot. You told me that, and mm. it is so much easier. It is easier. so much easier, because you haven't got fingers and thumbs Unless you've got the ring, the ring of jump. Unless you've got the ring of jump. Hook that through. It does take a little bit of wiggling. You see, I've opened it quite far, because obviously you've got quite a thick. Because it's thick, yeah. Aspects there. Like me. And then just pinch it back together. And I always leave the, per, um, the plastic on Do as a protection you? until I've finished. Because then, then it go. gives you that proper shine. It does. Obviously, if you're working on that um, without the covering on you can scratch the perspex it's not a problem you can use your dremel then to buff the surface back up again um, but it does create a really really nice glitzy finish to your piece this is so young and funky i love it yeah. this is for your sort of 20 to 30s audience uh, for your um customers Custom, yeah this is for um for those really fresh designs and, and maybe it's it's that you want to create a cop mobile yeah it, it doesn't have to be jewelry i mean how cool would this be oliver I want it. I, yeah. I want the cop mobile <laughs> for Ollie, please. Yeah. That's what we want. Yeah, we can do, absolutely. And we've had little discussions about what we're going to do next with our Christmas show with the Perspex. So we've had lots of discussions about had, Christmas. Make it happen. Make it happen. It's happening. Christmas decorations out of Perspex, cot mobiles out, out of perspex. perspex, key rings out of Perspex, little decorative bits and bobs out of Perspex. There is loads that you can do with this wonderful new medium. And if you've never used it before, then you must get funky. You've got to appeal to everyone as well, yeah, haven't you, you Hannah? Have. You've got to use a, a broad age range on your craft store. You're going to attract every customer that way. And also, it's the sort of thing you can actually sit at your craft store and make. If yeah, you and everyone's all, like, ooh, what's what she you doing? doing? Yeah, it creates a real good buzz because it's, it's quite, it looks full on, but actually it's really, really easy to do. It is, and I promise you, it is e literally as easy as soaring. It will go through like butter. You don't need a... No, you don't need You know what that is, right? <laughs> you knew what I meant, though. I don't know what it's called. £34.95. pence. Keep interacting with us today. We love your company. Uh, please uh, come through on our Facebook page. Let us know what you're thinking of the show so far. If you've got a question for Hannah, text on through 60777 JM Studio, followed by your message. So we were going to actually touch on that interaction with you because it is important with us, for us, especially when you send us in your designs. We're going to go and check those out right now. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's gorgeous very, Look at the detail I love chain. it. It's very fluid, isn't it? Very fluid. 432 here. Um, please find attached this week's entry to the Wall of Fame a swirly wire necklace inspired by the fab Gemma Crow. She's used amethyst and lapidolite from JM and she gets compliments every time she wears it. Ooh. And she says it's her favourite piece of jewellery. And that's from Helen in Where's Amanford. Am Where's Amanford? Amanford. Amanford? I'm not Amanford. sure. Where's that? Where's Amanford, Ollie? Tree of knowledge. <laughs> Amund, Amundford. No, I don't know where that is neither. Now, love pyrite oh, lapis lazuli like together. Combination. Well, it's, it's you've got to do yeah. it. Love it. Uh, number four, three, five is from Rebecca Lacey in Malden, who says. Dear JM, here is my entry to this week's Wall of Fame. I just received my order containing these um, rounds and pyrite hearts. Oh, oh she's saying they're black magnesite. I thought that was lapis. 
Mm. It's funny how it comes out different on the uh, camera, isn't it? As soon as I saw them, I wanted them <laughs> and wanted to create something to wear for my fifth wedding anniversary. Wow, congratulations. Wow. Um, love watching the show and picking up all the design ideas from Rebecca in Molden. Thank you so much, Rebecca. That is gorgeous. And congratulations on the wedding anniversary. Well done. I've got four, three, <gasps> three. Gorgeous is that sapphire? Oh, oh it's like sapphire. Mm -hmm. Hi, this is my entry to this week's Wall of Fame. Sapphire is my birthstone, so she purchased this strand of multicoloured sapphire. Managed to get a whole set of jewellery, which I was happy about. Struggled a bit with the beading thread, um, but a she's making a request for finer beading thread in the kits. Well, we can do that, but we've also been in talks to ensure that the drill holes are be like larger. Cylon as well. Yeah, we've got Eslon and, and things like that. Well, um, Eslon, I call it Cylon. Cylon. Yeah. Potato, potato. And that's from Susie and Aberdeen. Gorgeous, Susie. Well done. Check this out. Wow. Ooh. Factor 10. I like that. That's I good. love it. Very Laura um, inspired, yep. I'm sure. This is gorgeous. Wax white cone. It looks like it. Mm -hmm. 436 is from Dawn uh, Massey in Cheshire who says, Hi, all. Oh, been very unwell. Oh, no, Dawn, get better. Um, but her lucky win on the Wall of Fame two weeks ago, uh, woohoo! Uh, enabled her to finally buy the Viking knit, Lazy Daisy. And this is her first go at a bracelet. What, first go, that's see? Amazing. That's how amazing this <laughs> tool is. That is wonderful. Purple bills and end caps are JM, as is all the wire. What a great new tool and so forgiving. Made the band a bit too big to start with, so once it was pulled through the draw plate, this is why I love it. That yeah. draw plate, this is why I want human draw plates. <laughs> Everything. We could just eat cake all day and slide through the draw plate. <laughs> Brilliant. Uh, wouldn't that be good? Um, the draw plate, I had more than I needed, but it was um, then really easy to cut to size. Thanks so much, jewellery maker. Um, the shows have kept her sane uh, with the rest of the daytime TV has me going gaga. I know, I, I ironed the other day. I didn't know what was going on. <laughs> I'm not over that day of ironing. The whole day of my day off I spent ironing watching daytime TV and it not sent good. me mad. Yeah, I'm not surprised. That's I'm horrible. still. That's how I feel. <laughs> All wow! Look at that. How what? beautiful. All the weaving as well. <gasps> how does she do this? Is it a pendant that she's bought? Let's, Let's have see. a look. 434. Hi, all at JM. Uh, this is my entry for the week's Wall of Fame. It's Labradorite Cabochon Bezel Set in Copper. Oh, they're wire wrapped with copper wire. Mm. The chain is Byzantine chainmail with Labradorite three mil rounds and a fancy wire wrapped copper clasp. Took a wee while to make as there were quite a few techniques involved, but I think the time and effort were worth it. I hope it gets shown. Also, I just love your idea of inviting customers to apply for the post of guest designer. Yes. Well, Jean, I hope you have applied because that is absolutely stunning. It's wonderful. Jean in Alexandria. Jean in Alexandria. Where's Alexandria? No, it's not like in Egypt. I don't know. I don't know where that is, but it sounds very glamorous. Sounds very glamorous. Yeah. Well, a glam glamorous piece of jewellery as well. Fantastic. <laughs> Jean, very neat and tidy. I love it. Well done. Now, we will be returning to you with that very exclusive sapphire. Look at it. Are you new to jewellery maker? Would you like to try a new hobby? Then why not give us a call on 0800 644 655 and we'll send you a free copy of our DVD and booklet to help you get started. You don't even need to make an order. Get involved with jewellery maker. Here at the Genuine Gemstone Company, we are happy to announce that our studio store is now open. If you attend any of our courses, you can now browse through special items, get exclusive discounts and deals that you can't get at any other time. Become an exclusive customer at the studio store. For more information on available courses and dates, please contact our call centre. The new studio store. The experience just got better. You can now keep in touch by liking Jewelry Maker UK on Facebook. Get interactive with Jewelry Maker. 
If for any reason you're not satisfied, you have the benefit of our no quibble 30 day money back guarantee. Just complete the returns form enclosed with your goods and send them back for a full refund. Our commitment here at Jury Maker is to provide you with genuine gemstones. Many places might not be able to do that, but we want to guarantee it. So how do we do it? We go to the laboratories and we get tests. We have our own in-house gemologists that can guarantee that when we say genuine gemstones, that's exactly what you're getting. Join jewellery maker and guest designer Mark Smith for our long-awaited macrame workshop. Get to know the essential techniques and knotting formations to create these vastly popular designs. Learn square stitch, twist stitch, slip knot and much more. The full course includes a range of different threading materials, a selection of gemstones, use of all relevant tools, a buffet-style lunch and refreshments, a tour of the studios, a chance to meet the presenters and a visit to our Gemstone Museum. All of this for just $79.95. For more information, contact our call centre on 0800 644 655. Jewellery Maker, bringing out the designer in you. If you're shopping high-end today, if you're shopping high-end this week or this month, then this, my high-end shopping friend, is most certainly your day to shop with us because I have officially the most glamorous strand of sapphire that we've ever seen here at Jewelry Maker. This is going to be a considered purchase, but my goodness me, not in comparison to the rest of the world. This is a collector's choice sapphire strand that is beyond exceptional. In fact, it's pretty much beyond our wildest dreams. When we begin to jewelry make, when we first take apart that necklace that's been broken in your drawer for years, and you recreate it, and you get a little bit of a taste for jewelry making, in your wildest dreams, were you gonna buy a strand of sapphire specifically for jewelry making? Those deep sapphire blues are not something that is a regular occurrence here at Jewelry Maker. Neither indeed are the pinks or those almost papradashka colour. You have fabulous, almost Ceylon blue. Now this is a strand of true excellence and this is again going to be for you. If you have been thinking about creating very, very exclusive jewellery. Just look at it. We have never, ever seen sapphire like this before. Now, there is a huge temptation to keep this, clutch it, look at it every day, and just feel like one of the most privileged jewelry makers. It is a jeweler's strand for sure. Now, Oliver's just said to me, what he loves about this strand is the different shades of pink that you get and the different shades of blue that you get, taking you right from the very pale peach, which you don't see in sapphire very often, to the really rich pink, bordering on ruby, but not quite. It's very difficult to get a pink sapphire. Now, those deep, 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 look at the clarity, look at the clarity. This deep, 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 rich blue is passionate. And that's the sapphire we know, isn't it? That's the sapphire we see in most jewelers. Look at the one right on the bottom. Do you see that? Now there, there is a high-end gemstone. Now look, you've got that shiller. Can you see? Look. This has incredible midnight clarity. 
Just look at that. Mm-hmm. Now, whether these are going to be pendants, whether they're going to be earrings, they certainly would look wonderful in a bubble-style ring or bracelet. Whatever they are, please put them with precious metal findings because, my goodness me, they deserve it. Put them on a pedestal, wrap them up in cotton wool, bubble wrap these gemstones because they are exclusive. If you ever wanted to create jewellery to go and get valued, this would be one of the strands I would absolutely recommend to you. Yes, it is going to be a considered purchase. It is. How much? Is, how much are two carats of sapphire, even in a high street jewellers? It's expensive. It is. It's one of the world's most exclusive gemstones, isn't it? It's a sapphire strand. Now, you know there are sapphire strands here at Jewellery Maker that we see probably sapphire once or twice a week, and there are sapphire strands. This is oh, right up there right up there. Yellow sapphire you can see in the centre. You could make, just one of these would make an exquisite ring. If you are looking to create the most special Christmas present, then this is the strand to do it with. Remember this is a precious gemstone. Remember this is the gemstone that Princess Diana chose over every single gem. And of course if you didn't know, Prince Charles didn't get down on one knee. Um, and give her a ring. He had, he'd asked her to marry him and then he said go and pick a ring and so she went for a sapphire and it's the regal blues perhaps that drew her to her Ceylon sapphire. It's the subtlety and the class perhaps that drew her to a blue sapphire. Whatever it was that drew Princess Diana to that sapphire, we look at Princess Diana and we are inspired by her elegance and her beauty and you know what? You can see sapphire is such a highly regarded gemstone. Why it's so expensive elsewhere, it deserves to be, doesn't it? It deserves to be an expensive gemstone. It is one of the top four gemstones in the world. Diamonds, emeralds, rubies, sapphires. Now, if you want those cascading expensive earrings, if you want to display, if you want to display your jewellery in a glass cabinet going round and round, looking gorgeous in a boutique, if you have got to keep up a boutique collection, or if it's your ambition, in fact, to create boutique jewellery, then you absolutely have to get this strand. They are already going on the website. This is a collector's choice strand. I have the pleasure of Hannah Roxbury's company here today. Now, Hannah Roxbury, trots the globe looking for some of the most exclusive gemstones you can possibly bring you. Hannah, we don't see very many strands like this. Tell me why. We don't see many strands like that and we certainly don't see them with that kind of colour because these are formed by nature. It's whatever we can get at the time, you know. Mm -hmm. It's not like we can say, I want you to grow this much in this colour, in this size. It doesn't happen like that. We have to wait until the rough is on the market so our lepidurists can cut them and then we can select. And it's, it's a very, very rare occurrence that we get this saturation of colour across such an incredibly rare gemstone as well. Did you choose this strand? I have to, I have to say, Mrs. Bennett chose this strand. Paula Bennett chose this strand. She did indeed. She likes exclusive, she, she likes exquisite, she likes expensive. <laughs> yeah. And yeah. you can see, I mean, this is a bit of a princess strand, isn't yes, it? Yes, absolutely. It's the sort of strand that when I first started in the trade 11 years ago, I aspired to. I've always, always, always wanted to own something as precious as this. And it wasn't until I joined Jewelry Maker that I could actually afford to. And it's that, it's just, it just makes you feel special. You never in your wildest dreams think that no. unless you're a top jeweller, that you can even afford to buy these gemstones to set to then sell. Yeah. I mean, this is an opportunity and a half right here. So pick up the phone and dial if you don't want to miss out. So 800 already very popular on the website. It is a considered purchase, but you can see why. No consideration in grabbing this strand at 59.95 when you know that you're going to create something beautiful with it. Don't forget your 30 day money back guarantee. We always offer you that here at Jewelry Maker and it's important because we want you to get this strand home. See how incredibly beautiful it is. Again, please set it 
in precious metal because it deserves it. For the most exclusive gift, for the most exquisite jewellery, here is your jeweller's strand, GQG Z46. It's a wildest dreams opportunity. It's definitely for the collectors amongst you. It's definitely for the more elitist jewellery makers of you. And it's for the jewellery maker, again, that's just got to have everything. For $59.95, you've got it. You're there. You're high end. You are the elite. Well done. It is wonderful to see that so many of you are in love with this strand because I know the minute I saw it this morning, I fell in love with it. In fact, Laura had this draped around her hand this morning and was having a little look how lovely, isn't this lovely, um, in the style of Stevie Wonder song going on. Look at this. It is gorgeous, isn't it? How do you feel about having a new tool. What's going on here? Do not take the wire out. Right, okay, I won't. <laughs> I won't cast, don't be worrying. Don't even mention the wire, she said, and I was like, wire, there's wire. You can't tell me anything, Cass, you know that. Have a look <laughs> at this tool. If you want to create out of thicker wire, out of thicker wire, the twisting technique, here it is. Talk to me, Hannah Roxbury, for I know nothing about this <laughs> brand new tool. What does it do? How can I use it? Is it just wire? It looks great, I need it, it looks all professional. <laughs> Tell me everything I need to know. Well, the wire twisting pliers, and they were actually um, brought in by um, a customer on the Sunday Experience. I'm coming over to you, I can't miss <laughs> it. Go on, go on, I'm she listening. Was, yeah, she was brought in by a customer in um, Sunday Experience. She said, you know, I love the wire twister tool that you have with the disc, but what I want is something more heavy duty. So she showed me these, and it was me that was tasked to then find them. So that's what we did. And wire twisting is majorly popular. It is, it is. If you're looking down to channel sort of Celtic inspired designs. Yes, it is, isn't it's it? It's really, really big at the moment. So. Kind of uh, medieval actually it as is, well, yeah. I reckon, because you do see these kind of embellishments in the medieval you do. You period. Do. And it just adds that different look to your wire as well. I mean, you can obviously double up your wire and make thicker wire so it's stronger to use in your designs. But it's just that beautiful look it gives. And it does. It really does, right from a delicate bangle yeah. to a big thick ring. So can I use my one mil wire with this? Can I use my 1.5 wire with this? You can, You'd have to. what you have to do is um, hammer the ends flat so they grip inside the pliers because obviously you're trying to hold a very round piece in, in the pliers. Perfect, but it's flat and absolutely it something you can yep, do. Absolutely. absolutely. Right, now this do. does look very professional. Now I'm going to give you a price tag and then Hannah's going to show us. Should I not touch it because it's set up? <laughs> it's all set up? I want yeah. to pull this out because it's got like a little piggy tail. You can pull that, that's fine. Piggy tail. <laughs> $14.95 but this is a good quality tool. Very, very heavy weight. Now I don't, I don't know how it works but I can feel it's good quality. <laughs> I don't work like that basically. What? I just do this to yep. twist it. And what you'd have on the other end is the end of the wire clamped in place. Oh, yeah. Okay, so show me. Okay, right. So, if you um, do some price comparing, um, Laura's just saying because these, these are really, are really, expensive. really, really expensive pair of pliers elsewhere, not here. Not here. So, what you're doing is, if I can get that in shot, you've got mm. a little catch system just at the tip of the pliers here. Oh, well, that's what that is. Yeah, go on, a little go on. catch system. I hope I can get it back into place because because they're, they're new out of the packaging, they're a little bit stiff. But you squeeze those down. And that unlocks oh, the pliers. Oh, oh, okay, okay. Okay. So we put them back in, and you have to really squeeze. And then draw down. And draw that area down, and that is then locked in place. I can do that okay. again if you, if you Did want. Did you get that, everybody? I could do that, you know, I can do it. Okay, so. I'm not going to. So once that is pulled down, squeeze, it pull, locks this, squeeze, this side of the plier in place. So you mm -hmm. pull that down, lock this side. At this point, my wire isn't twisted it's though. Not so twisted, what do no. I do? Just put them next to each other? Yep, yeah, what you've done is folded your wire over and then put both ends in here. So you've got two lengths of basically untwisted what, wire. What, just sticking out of there? Just sticking out of the pliers. Yeah, you don't have to How fit them in this area. How does that connect to that? So basically, you'd have that clamped. So if you want to hold that end, yeah. hold it tight. 
And what you're doing is twisting. Oh, and they, I see. And then you, you can't quite pick it up on television, but they twist that's themselves. A, that's brilliant. And you'll, brilliant. you'll find the resistance in the plier itself. You need, obviously, a really, really strong clamp at that end. But because you're twisting, it's then twisting for you. So you're not actually having to physically move this. As you pull, it twists. It twists. Oh yes, <laughs> I love this. Yeah, but yeah, easy have peasy lemon place. squeezy. Easy peasy. Really, so you really can quick. use it with any density of wire. Mm -hmm. Fourteen easy peasy lemon squeezy, Oliver. Now this is great. So I, because I really want to create one of those really thick bangles at a one point five mm -hmm. wire. Now I can do it. Yeah, it would take a little bit of work, as I say, because you're putting quite rounded um, wire ends into the plier grips there. I can flatten with my chase flatten hammer. Them. Yeah, Fine. flatten them. First. Okay. So flat with the chase, I'm very excited because what I want to do, Hannah, is I want to make a wire work bangle with the 1.5. Yeah, a, proper a tool. nice, yeah. Mm. This is a jeweler's tool a again. You've got tool. to be, a, what a wonderful tool. 14, that 95, <laughs> I love this. We've waited for it, haven't we? Mm -hmm. We want a wire, we love the wire twister. Now I can wire twist my thicker depths, yeah. my thicker gauges. Very, very quick. Literally came in the building today. We don't have a photograph of it. Nope. We don't have the demo <laughs> of it, but we know how to use it. Don't worry. So you can. Hannah will put a little bit of a tutorial, perhaps. So squeeze here. No, I'm not Did you see it. it released? Now I can open. Listen, listen, if I can do this, everybody's all right. Now really squeeze, squeeze and pull. Push. 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 What, that way? This way towards me. That's pull to me. No, it's push. Pull. That's mm -hmm. pull. That's pull. push. Pull. Pull. Yeah. So now I'm in. So you're in. You're locked. And now I'm just twisting here, yeah? Yeah, just pulling that. And um, obviously, if it's then clamped in a vice, this area of the plier will twist around. Easy. Easy peasy. Easy. I can do it. This is easier than the smaller one because I don't have to take it apart. <laughs> Easy. You need this. I want to make a 1.5 wire bangle. Mm. Let's do it. <laughs> Gorgeous. Oh, two different lovely colours. How wonderful is this tool? Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Make sure you let us know. How do you do your wire twisting now? Don't you just love this? So it's just twisting it. Mm-hmm. Isn't that crazy? I don't need to put it inside or nope. anything? No. Nope. How mad is that? Because the twist that? movement comes from the plier face itself. Because you're doing that? Yeah. This is a major benefit. A major benefit because you can, but it's just so easy. Otherwise, Hannah, uh, Hannah Roxby, Gemma Crow was putting, um, putting hers on the end of a door handler, kitchen door, and standing there and twisting for ages, 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 ages. Yeah. She c this is just wonderful. And because I know how much I love that wire twister tool, it is easy to use, you just, um, but this is great because yeah. now, You've got much more of a I can use the wider gauges and I can make something really cool. Mm -hmm. Can I then flatten it once it's twisted? Absolutely. Oh, yeah, I love this through. idea. Yeah, it will look amazing. And you can even texture it. Texture the yes, wire you could. using the die cutting machine and the textured sheets. If you haven't got your chase hammer, add it to your order. $14.95. This is incredible. Wonderful. Do you know what a big percentage? Do we know exactly how what's gone? It's gonna sell out. Approaching 80% of the entire stock has gone on this one for 14.95. You've got to act fast. Do not miss out on this. T X Z X 73. Good grief! What a number. Oh, you don't want to miss out. Oh, we had quite a lot of those as well. Crikey! Oh, I can't wait. Wire twister tools are just really popular. Let's have a sip of tea, shall we? Did you get one? Did I you did get, get one? A tea. It's down here. Mm. Look at that. Mm. Going off shot as well, brilliant. Let's leave her alone. Come on, <laughs> I love you. Let's go and do that. You. Do you remember that luscious barrel? Oh, is that on next? Oh, it's on now, Hannah. Oh, it's on now. I, I love it. It's very, very decadent looking. It's very, very expensive looking. You have got to adore this strand. Now. Be quick with the with the tool because they are very very popular indeed. Now let's talk to you about we've we've spoken about bold statement pieces. We've spoken about the really really exclusive collection. Now this isn't going to be a tiny price tag. It's a gems of distinction strand and it is one of our most exclusive strands of beryl. And I'll tell you again for why because of the excellent Clarity. Morganite, aquamarine, and heliodor. 
Okay, let's get serious because you have got aquamarine with this kind of clarity. Again, again, and I, I don't say this lightheartedly, I mean this. This is a jeweler's gemstone strand again. The clarity, the clarity is mind blowing. Look at that heliodor. Look at that aquamarine. I'm talking exclusive. I am talking high end. It's a brand new strand. Look at that. Look at that colour. I just want to look at it. I wasn't even thinking design. I was thinking, mm. because Laura just said, I need to make a tiara out of that. I need to make some drop earrings. Do you know, Laura, I wasn't even thinking about jewelry making. I just wanted it. I wonder if you're the same, you think, I don't know what I'm going to do. I just want it. Oliver's just said, I'm getting this for my wife's Christmas. Are you really? Oh my gosh, isn't it gorgeous? Oh, sorry. <laughs> Is she watching? <laughs> sorry, Vicky. Vicky wants it, don't stop. Look at this. <laughs> Look at the aquamarine. The morganite is exceptional. These are top drilled. You have got to use sterling silver wire with this. You have got to. Look at this. I need it, it's exquisite, it's, it's just breathtaking, like little tiny raindrops, little delicate, beautiful tiny raindrops. This, it, it really is special. It really is. I don't even care how much it is, I want it. Okay, there's lots of you on the phone lines and, and a lot of these have already gone on the website. Let's give you a, what, how much is it? Is it expensive, yeah? This is naturally, exquisitely beautiful of course the barrel family giving us you have this is not this is a great price tag 1995 good i mean this is the this is That's the good. best barrel now i show you barrel and i've said wow what amazing be barrel before this is the best this is the best this is the best yeah this is definitely the best i've seen the cutting of it is so decadent because what you've actually got is almost like a star cutting because it's, it reminds me of, like Laura said, tiaras, when you have those diamonds which have the rose cut and the star cut to them. <gasps> Antique tiaras, it's that same cut. This, this really, I mean, the cut's exquisite. These oh. really should be in high-end jewellery. These really should be in, in, you know that jewellers in your town or city that you, you wish you could buy things from? They belong in there. And I think this is what this is the best barrel we've ever had. We undoubtedly, undoubtedly. The clarity. I just. I'm going to be honest. I can't even get over the, for 1995. You're getting such utter, utter, utter beauty. There is no way I can work out how many are on here, Laura. I'll count like an inch. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. But on that, so so that times six is what? It's twelve times six, round, Josh. That's about you got about seventy-two on here. So that's approximate. I just counted an inch and times it. Look at that. I, I do need to make sure they know how I work things out because I am pretty unconfident of my own mathematical workings. I do, do you know, you just want to look at something and you feel like this is Cinderella's glass slipper. This is, do you know what I mean? This is absolutely magical. This is the one. This is, the, this is that, it is a princess strand. That's a, I, do, I don't want to say Disney princess because it's not for kids. <laughs> it's not for kids, it's not for you. Maybe it will if you want it. Maybe you've got a lovely little spoiled princess. 1995, I'm just in awe of anyone who got that because I think it's so beautiful. 
so beautiful. This clarity is spot on. It, everyone's gone, oh, whoo, Hannah Roxbury. <laughs> I still got so much to come in today's show. I am so excited. Look. Look at this. Mm -hmm. Wow. Do you love it? I do too. The size of this. Morganite earrings with the barrel. Mm -hmm. With the barrel. Of course they come from the same. Oh, yes. Good idea. Now, my darlings, this is coming up for you. Well, how long are we going to make them wait? A bit longer? A little bit longer, says Laura. Let's do Tanzanite then. Oh, Tanzanite. I love that we're getting Tanzanite strands in. Hannah, talk to me because this used to be so unavailable. Oh, we're not doing it now. She's teasing us again. We're talking a minute. Okay. But she were a little Malteser again, Laura. Yesterday you were a Malteser and you're a Malteser again today. Ruby, undetected change from a tenner? No. One, no, a whole strand. Morganite, Tanzanite, Sapphire, Ruby, spoiling you like a mountain of Ferrero Rochers. Other chocolates are available. Have a look. We are really spoiling us. I know the Rainbow Moonstone as well, I know. Oh, today is, we should have come in ball gowns today, actually. <laughs> should have happened. Next time next time because I've just bought a new one for the not for any reason because I'm not going to ball but because it was in the sale I was like I love that I've got nowhere to wear it but it's coming home with me now where should we go let's go to let's do some more wire because I've just bought that new tool I want some more wire is that okay in my mind I've bought that new tool but have I got it really can I get it is there any left oh you rat bag Whee! It's not really a rat bag, it's just that you know when you want something, you're like, Ugh. oh no, something happened. Oh no, it's all right, I'm just going under. Oh, I thought I dropped it and I thought it unraveled. Ugh. But it was fine. <laughs> something happened. You know, I do often hear crashes, you know, like, oh, what have I done? Anyway, have a look. 0.4 antique bronze wire for your little weavy weavies, for your little wire twisted tool, for your tiara. 0.8. Then you've got one mil. Hey, stay where you are. One mil. I do it like that so you can see. Then I've got 0.4 in the copper as well. One mil, which I can do with my big wire twister. And I got 0 0.6. So we've got wire work mountain for you. So you've got 10 meters of antique bronze 0 0.4, 10 meters of antique bronze, one mil, 10 meters of copper, one mil, 10 meters of antique bronze 0 0.6, 10 meters of copper 0 0.4, and the same in 0 uh, 0 0.8. REG C27, the vintage wire bundle. If you love that steampunk look, this is for you. If, like me, you're very excited to twist these two colours together, this is for you. The Gemma Crows, who's Gemma Fro? Gemma, <laughs> that's her new name, Gemma Fro. Uh, Gemma Crow's favourite uh, combination. Hannah, do you love these vintage? I know you oh, love them. They're vintage. my favourite, absolute favourite. Because for me, I would grab these and I would mix them in and mix my own polymer clay colours so they match. Have a look. Polymer clay colours? Do you do loads of polymer clay? Yeah. Just registered what you just said then. Yeah, I do lots and lots of polymer clay. I'd like to see more. Mm hmm You can see more. Uh, do, can you do a polymer clay pony for me, please? <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, I take requests. I haven't had any polymer clay ponies yet. I would also like to do polymer clay village. 
You know, I'm obsessed with um, creating villages out of anything. Mm. I loved, I've loved to do that since I was little. Can we make Polymer Clay Village? We should make Polymer Clay Village. I've got stationary village, like on uh, Mighty Boosh. I can't go anywhere. There's Wirework Village to uh, <laughs> have a look at this. I've got, I, my kids are obsessed with the Mighty Boosh. Now, 0.4 is what's going to do your little inny outy weavy bits. I'm just going to, I've got to show you something. I'm going for a walk, Ryan. I'm going for a walk. I've got so many. I'm not there, Ryan. What are you doing about it, Rye Rye? <laughs> now, have a look. I'm obsessed with this bird to oh, the point amazing. where I go to bed and think, I want that bird. You know? Amazing bird. Have a look. Oh, Cassie, what have you got? Oh, Cassie, yes. I love this bird so much. <laughs> but do you know why I keep thinking about it? I keep thinking about Christmas. I keep thinking about my Christmas tree and how much better my Christmas tree will be when it's covered in these birds. Yeah. Literally covered. Wire work can achieve that. Vintage pieces. You have got a Laura binding style here. Look at this. This is out of the same wire. Wonderful. Absolutely wonderful. Who did this? Wonderful. It looks like a Laura. I'm not sure though. Look at this by Rachel Norris. Fabulous. Gizmo work. You can create gizmo work. Oh, Ryan, look at this, my darling cameraman. This is incredible. Look, look. And this is using beading thread with wire in the same colour. Love it. Karen Crawford is a literal genius. She, some people were born to do certain things. That lady was born to do wire work. If you, if like me, you weren't born to do anything but you quite like trying it, then go and grab one of our DVDs. Take inspiration from our wonderful guest designers. We're going to give you all of this for a very small price, like $12.95. If this is the first time you've ever tried wire work, you're going to get a free DVD that takes you step by step 60 meters for $12.95. Make your own findings, get your fabulous findings DVD, wire work for beginners. Don't worry about having to get a, a DVD. It's there to help you. But we also have free downloads on our website, which is jewelrymaker.com. This really is a fabulous deal. And I think YouTube, YouTube channel with the masterclass, there was the bird. I love it. I have to watch that, aren't I? Well, the antique bronze is perfect if you want to make robins, isn't it? Make yes, Christmas Hannah tree. Oxbury it is. Mm. How many robins can you um, produce? I don't know. <laughs> Not literally. I mean, like, I mean, is what I was going to say Stop. in a day. In a day. Create in a day, not produce, because they're not children. Maybe, um, I don't know, maybe three if you if you work super, super well, hard. Three, Hannah, work faster. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a, you don't know how big my Christmas tree is going to be. <laughs> I want more. I, <laughs> I knew it. I'm going to have to employ Oompa Loompas. They get the work done. There's <laughs> lots of you here on the phone lines. We love having your company so much. You're going to love, 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 love wire work. If, if you're not already massively involved in wire work, then you're just going to have a big smile. Look at that. Woo, Rosanna. Look at all of this wire. Create wire work village. What? Hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. Wire work nativity village. It's happening. You need to create polymer clay and wire work nativity. It's already happening, isn't it? It is, isn't it? With a little baby Jesus. <laughs> I love nativities, do you? Can you make it so that it fits in a particular angle in my house? I'll give you the dimensions. <laughs> okay, yes, I shall do that. Anything I can help you with? Straw, donkeys, pigs. Pig, there was a, probably a pig there. Mangers. Why work <laughs> mangers? Mangers. <laughs> I mean, I mean, <laughs> they're all taking it. Mangers? Mangers. Way in a manger. Uh, when, when we were little and we used to sing that because we were from Gloucestershire, it wasn't way in a manger like it was when everyone else is. Uh, way in a manger. <laughs> no crib. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> Manger. Now, let's go to you. 
I was normal until I said the word manger. <laughs> I do do that. I'll come out with something. This is why. This is why your children have to go. Look, mummy, stop talking, because you've just embarrassed me in front of everyone. Now, we got told yesterday the whole family to leave Mia because she was not help. We weren't helping because she was trying to focus, and all this isn't helping. Right. She was on our horse, right? We're all watching her, and I was going, yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, I was saying something, probably being a bit like, come on, yeah. And we were all talking, I was talking to Max, and she stopped the horse, she looked at me and she said, excuse me, can you all just leave? I am trying to focus, and it's like this. I can't concentrate. To which I said, you should be in a mode where you're focusing no matter what's going on around you. And she went, just leave. It's like, all right, fine. I'm glad to see I taught you manners. Oh, tell you what. Anyway, if you've got a preteen, you feel me. You feel me. Mesh. Mesh in these pots. Hannah, how is it that they are less expensive but better? What's that all about? Because that doesn't happen. I don't know. I just sourced them. Just got them made. You're just good. <laughs> you and uh, you and Lady Crow Crow did these together, didn't you? Yes, we did. So you've got this lovely colour, I love this copper colour, and you've got the black. I'm also going to give you all this chain, am I? Aren't I generous? Now, <laughs> isn't Laura generous? Now, you can see I'm twisting this around. It comes quite untangled, unless I've touched it. Ten metres. Now, the chain last week was one of our most popular, popular, popular buys. I am going to undo this. And again, we're going to give you a wonderful price tag. Have you got an open basket? How much was the chain on its own? This is the gold one. Shut up. 11 95 for chain on its own. And she's giving everybody the mesh as well. Oh, if you don't know what, to quit, what you're actually making out of the mesh, go and have a look at Gemma's. Oh my gosh, that rose. Oh, it's beautiful. Go onto our Facebook page. Go onto Gemma Crow stuff. Oh my goodness. She's also got working with Mesh DVD, hasn't she, Laura? Um, Laura? Who's Laura? But Hannah. It's because I'm looking at Laura. Working with Mesh the DVD. Is it that Why one? Mesh? Why Mesh DVD? I don't think it's out yet, is it? Is it out? Yeah, it's, it's out. out. Oh, yeah. goodness me. That shows how behind I am. Where have you been? <laughs> it's not, not about. Working. Yeah. Working, that's where. Mm -hmm. Look at all of this. Working nine to five. She's working more than that. She never stops. <laughs> she never stops. So you've got all this chain. Ten meters goes on. Look at that lovely colour. Twelve ninety-five. Look at that. I love Dolly Parton. Do you? She's, She's a maze balls. Coat of many colours is one that I like. That makes me cry. That my mama made for me. <laughs> it looks like this is sold out. Well done, my little jewelry making darlings. <laughs> now, can we do box 14? Would that be all right? Because it reminds me of streams and kind of summery. Just got news that Ben's lost his car keys, have we? <laughs> I do that every single day. Do you, Hannah? Um, no. Right, Sheila look does. at these colours. Aren't they fab? Now this is a great Sutash bundle, isn't it? Yes. Not for the beach. chips, but for the others. Are you into suit? Have you done it yet? I haven't done it yet. No. You I've could do it in Colin McClay. Yeah, yeah, do that one. But not in the cord. Now you've got two strands of perfect rounds. Beady beads every time. Beady beads are great. Putting these on the end of tassels is wonderful. Now there's a lot that you can do with this colour as well. I love this green. I love it. It makes me happy. Green is fab, isn't it? That's luscious green. And look at these long chips. 14 by 4 to 21 by 7. It's called Sea Goddess. Do you know what this reminds me of? I know what it reminds me of now. What's it called? <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 not C. Yeah, C. Yes, C. The Japanese animation for Ponyo. Reminds me of Ponyo. The one with Liam Neeson. 
Ponyo! Haven't you seen Spirited Away? Because it's all, it's all under the sea, it's amazing. It's the most amazing animation ever. It's got all these wonderful colours and that, this is exactly what it's like. And what these remind me of are the bubbles, the little bubbles. Oh, it's wonderful, you must have a look. Just go and Google it and you'll see what I mean. It's lovely, lovely colours. And look at that Labradorite. There's the bubbles, the, the bubbles of the Labradorite, aren't they? Fabulous green, fabulous blue, and a softer meadow green with the long chips. I really like this. Lots and lots of texture. Whether you've got the Chip and Nugget DVD or not, I think you're going to be able to create a lot with this. Hannah, look at the colours. I know that you love colour. You're a real mm. fan of sort of mixing these bold statement colours. What are you thinking with this bundle? Isn't it fabulous? I, do you know what I'd actually do? I'd bring in the antique bronze wire that we had from that bundle just now, and I would yeah. love to create a woven bracelet design, a big funky cuff. Loads of texture. Are you yeah. standing the long chips yeah, up to attention? Them, yeah, Gemma Crow style. Brilliant. I think so, because that's what Gemma does as, as well, yeah. isn't it? Stands them up, lets them stand proud. VCG C07. The Sea Goddess. This is a lovely one, isn't it? <laughs> I went, wait, what? What? I won't say it out loud, but look at your price tag. So Laura went, Laura likes to call everybody by their actual full names. Like she goes, Jenny Cleary at me all the time. She went, sorry, Hannah Oxbury. Oh, ain't that for four strands? Yeah, it's two pound. I thought we 25, had 25, not I, even that. I thought we'd 22. finished our clearance half hour. Obviously not. I think you're going to get fired. <laughs> 8.95. When are you going away? Laura wants to know. After the show. Oh. So will you be turning your mobile off and not communicating with the rest of the jury maker world full stop forever I, for that week? If, if it worked like that, it, I would do, but it doesn't work like that. Okay, then you're in trouble, uh, Laura Andrelios. She will be uh, making calls. Apparently Scott loves it. And Scott would. <laughs> Scott's, Scott's dancing. It's like a little leprechaun. I think Scott needs to come out here. And that dance. price tag. He's like Rumpel Stiltskin. Eight ninety five. <laughs> Oliver, don't forget you need to now be remembering all of your nursery rhymes. Rumpel Stiltskin is my favourite ones. What's your favourite nursery tale? <laughs> I don't know. Mine's Hansel and Gretel and oh. Rumpel's. I'm a big Brothers oh. Grimm fan. What do you like? Hansel and Gretel. I love Hansel and I Gretel. I quite like the Country Mouse and the Town, Town Mouse. Town Mouse, Country Mouse. Yeah. I can, I can see that. Ain't no Brothers Grimm though, is it? <laughs> Not so much. <laughs> I like the Porridge Pot one as well, where it overfloweth. And one eyes, two eyes and three eyes. That's brilliant. No. Let's go to, can we do the cord? Can we do the um, cord bundle? If anyone ever wanted to buy me a present, the greatest thing would be the full collection of Brothers Grimm. Oh. I did used to live in Bristol. I used, I love it. Oh my God, I loved living in Bristol. It's a, an amazing city. Clifton is so pretty. The zoo is amazing. I once went to this party and um, I had load. I wasn't drinking, I was driving, so I had loads of energy drinks. You know the ones I'm on about, like five or six of them, and it made me go crazy. And I thought I was like, oh, I've gone crazy on energy drinks. Uh, I'm seeing giraffes. I've got to go home. I don't feel right. And they were like, no, that's the zoo. <laughs> it was fine. I was like, fine, I'm now all right. Let's continue. Now. Have a look at what I got for you. Suede. And then you've got those lovely yellows in the cord. Talk to me about the suede, Hannah. We what's the difference between this and the suede? And do we get more? Is it that the texture's different? Is it a different thickness? Will it not fray? Tell me everything you know. It's a different thickness um, in that the suede is um, animal hide, so that is real leather. Raw hide. <laughs> and the suede is man-made, manufactured version. And you'll see it's not as crumbly as what suede. Is. I don't find suede crumbly though. I just li I like it because it's yeah. It's then, more so textured. if you were like a vegetarian and things like yeah, that, you don't want to work with. Yeah, this is a good way to come in to get the same effect, 
but obviously do not I get payment. more of this for the price yes because suede is expensive suede is very expensive being unless leather. you shop here which yeah it should be expensive it's only 9.95 and you get one two three four five six seven eight one two three four five six seven eight nine ten reels because the other two are your oh I love these different colors are your cord JCG C87 love cord if you want to do your suit attached with this again you can if you want to do um, just to accommodate pendants you can how many sorry Laura how many on each reel how many on each reel how much sorry how many meters 10 meters on each reel that is a lot mm -hmm. 80 meters of suede I love this will this Laura said that's gonna sell out <laughs> all right then saying like we're on the archers I love that what radio station is that on because I'm missing it have a look have a look at what we got I love so just listen just listen to the word sunstone mm. it sounds warm it sounds magic it sounds magical and I like that I do I am a little bit of a fantasist I think I like to think about magic and I like to think about I love this I just think to tell your customer I've got a lovely sunstone pair of earrings you might like just a very sound oh yeah I am I do like that let us have a look I think this is a gemstone that is so pretty. Do you know what gives this gem? Because it is very similar. The makeup of this gemstone is extremely close to moonstone, apart from one important factor. Little teeny weeny stars, I call them, of copper are sparkled. That's what the glitter is. The glistening, the sparkle, that essence, that is copper. Tiny, weeny, weeny bits. I think they're like stars, do you? Little copper stars. Look at them, look at them. Mm, love them, like fireworks going off inside these gemstones. And let's talk about, let's talk about this colour because it's autumnal. Let's talk about this tone because it works so well with your chocolate tones. Let's talk about this shape because the round is your very best friend when it comes to jewellery making, isn't it? It's your beady bead, it's your stretchy bracelet, it's your earrings. This will work so well with that gold chain you've got in your stash. This is going to look absolutely wonderful with those smoky cords, bicones. Now, if you can't wear in the clothing, which I can't, that nude tone, I can't get away with that, but I certainly love the fashion. I'll, I'll wear it in my jewelry instead, thank you very much. Then this is one for you. I think it can be very bridesmaidy. I think it looks wonderful next to Amazonite. Think about it next to the coolness of Amazonite, but it also great against things like chocolate pearls. And it's a very elegant gemstone, Lady Oxbury, isn't it? It is a really really elegant gemstone and again like you say the nude tone's been really key this season but it's a talking point you know if you're selling to customers if you're selling to friends or family or even giving gifts yeah write out a little card explain what what sunstone is add to that mystery add to that magical essence of this gemstone I, I love sunstone do you know what the myth and legend behind this is <coughs> look it up look it up lady androly i need to know I need to know Lady Andrelia. Introducing Lady Andrelia. Look at this, come on, I'm in love. Do you love it? It's very romantic. Think lace with this. Mm. Lace and white pearls or creamy keshi pearls with the texture. Oh, I like that idea. You're kidding me, you're kidding me, Laura. How much is this? I heard, I knew I heard Ollie say that. You are a keeper of secrets and a Malteser. Lady Androlia, the keeper of secrets. I'm gonna write you into my new book that I'm writing. You are the keep, you are the secret keeper.
Look, look. I'm not going to tell her. I'm not going to tell her. Oh, man. <laughs> I'm within throwing distance. <laughs> She's got saws and hammers over there. I've just got, I've just got to go and buy <laughs> some more. That's the thing. I don't know if I can get it in again for that price. It's really naughty. Oh, I think it. I think it's great for everybody because they, it's such a great deal. But great for us, no. Because when <laughs> I give you sunstone, that is his actual price. Everyone will go. Oh. And sunstone was only seven ninety five last week. Hannah's. Hannah's put the price up. <laughs> but it's not. It's because Laura Androlia, the keeper of secrets, the little Malteser, has in fact done this. Maybe to antagonise tool keeper Hannah, I'm not sure. <laughs> You're the secret keeper, Hannah is the tool keeper. I am. Crikey. Oh, it's all it's all gone bananas in here today. I can feel that you're actually a little... I can feel your um, aura. Yeah. You really aren't happy about that. I'm, I'm happy for the customers, obviously, but I don't know whether I can get that in again for that price, because it takes forever. Laura, myth and legend, what was it? What's the myth and legend between, behind Sunstone? I want to know, please. Because I like to write those little cards out. You know, when I give gifts for Christmas, because all of my jewellery, never sell it, it's always gifts. Oh, I'm going to put this on. Myth and legend behind Sunstone. Let's talk about that. I'm sure I knew it. Is it fertility? Is, oh, there's a medieval myth and legend. Mm. Oh, there's a story. What's it to do with? You can't tell us in a nutshell. It's really long, she says. What about just nutshell it? It's a medieval story. I'll read it tonight. It seems though you can't. You don't have the time, do you, to read stories? Seven ninety-five. Wow. I do think it's magical, though. It is, isn't it? Maybe we could have a medieval banquet day. That would be good, Ryan. I'll bring in a suckling pig. I won't, actually. I'm against that because of the pig. That would be like Hannah bringing in a roasted cat. <laughs> no. <laughs> Nobody no. roasts cats. We don't do that in this country. No. We wouldn't. My daughter's a vegetarian, which is very hard, seeing as though we lived on a beef farm. Now, I'm going to show you. It's very special. Our oh, Morganite. It is going under fifty pounds, and it is exclusive. Go and have a little bit of a search engine search, because that's all you can do on a search engine is search. Go and have a look at Morganite, and then I'll see you. You can put this in your jewellery, and we want to know about what you're going to do with it. We'll be right back after this. Need a helping hand to get started with Jewelry Maker? Are you stuck for ideas and need inspiration? Then visit our Jewelry Maker website where you can find our video tutorials. Expand your knowledge and skills with these easy to follow jewelry making demonstrations. Whether you're a beginner, hobbyist, or business owner, there's always something new to learn. It couldn't be easier. Simply click and learn some new jewelry making techniques. We all know you need the right tools for the job, so here at Jewelry Maker, we have designed a kit to make sure you have all the essentials to join in with the fun. 
with round nose, flat nose and wire cutter pliers, as well as a reamer, tweezers and a bead scoop, you've got everything you need in one place for just $9.95. We provide the tools, you provide the skills. Join guest designer Debbie Bulford as she guides you through numerous techniques for creating flowers and leaves, from simple daisy canes to elaborate floral pieces. If you're looking to create unique handmade jewellery, then this is the course for you. The full course includes black and white clay, a colour clay pack of your choice, use of all tools, a buffet-style lunch and refreshments, and all for just $67.95. For details on course dates and availability, contact our call centre now on 0800 644 655. Jewellery Maker, bringing out the designer in you. Add to your collection with our Memory Wire DVD, which is full of hints and tips and step-by-step -step instructions for all levels. Follow Lucy and Debbie as they take you through how to create bracelets, necklaces and rings using memory wire. To get your hands on a copy, phone our call centre on 0800 644 655. Jewellery Maker, bringing out the designer in you. If you want to create with a gemstone that some of the world's greatest designers are creating with, I talk to you about well the names that come to mind first of all, Cartier, Tiffany & Co, Boodles, Bulgari. I could go on, the list does in indeed go on. Now, Morganite is a gemstone that was in the Marilyn Monroe collection, it's rumoured. It's a gemstone that in fact in the classic Hollywood era was really out there. It's one of those Elizabeth Taylor, Marilyn Monroe moments that we're having here, isn't it? When was the last time you saw Morganite like this? It's coming up for you in literally a couple of minutes time. You're not gonna wanna miss out. Now, I'm gonna give to you that tanzanite strand. It's about being exquisite, not only in our designs, but also with the gemstones that we use in our jewelry. And indeed, therefore, in the, in the final result, the jewelry that you've produ produced, exquisite, beautiful jewelry. Now with tanzanite, I'm speaking to you about a gemstone that is probably one of the world's most popular gemstones said to be a thousand times rarer than a diamond. Tiffany & Co launched Tanzanite and ever since, ever since the world's gone mad for this exclusive player croic gemstone. And player croism means that you're not just getting one solid colour from a gemstone and not, not many gemstones give us this. When the light travels into Tanzanite, you get the most amazing refraction. You get pinks, you get burgundies, you get blues, of course. We see this gemstone for tens of thousands of pounds in the very fine grays, of course. Look, look at this color. And you've got the most incredible outlines of pink. Now to get tanzanite in anybody's collection is a dream come true. This is a gemstone that's only mined in one place in the world. There's one mine, just one. And yet, it's one of the world's most popular gemstones. It's a gemstone strand that we see, a gemstone, not a gemstone strand, a gemstone that we see in some of the most exclusive jewelers. Have a look at this. Think about cascading these in earrings. Think about putting these as clusters. Think about putting these as little beautiful charms. 
on a necklace of real gold or real silver. Now, I want you to keep some of these in your collection. I want you to make sure that these are special. I want you to make sure that you put these, maybe keep some of them. What will happen to this gemstone's value if they say, it's run out, it's gone? Go and have a little research on Tanzanite. They say that this is the gemstone of our generation. This is the gem gemstone that is December's birth gemstone. You have got an opportunity here to own it. You have got an opportunity here. Wire wrap it. Rosary link it. Now, this gemstone strand should be well in the 30s. The quality is truly excellent. We really are giving you some insanely beautiful gemstones today. It is very high-end today. The theme is most certainly high-end, isn't it? Oh, you are so spoiled today. You get to make that bridal blue piece. This is a gemstone that's set to mark new beginnings, so it is perfect perfect as a bridal gemstone. Here is December's birth gemstone. Here is a gemstone that is also said to be the greatest gift to somebody who's just had a baby. For the Gems of Distinction Collection BRJN68, you are getting and another incredible price from the pocket of Laura Androlia to the collection that you're going to create high-end pieces. Earrings, you could sell those for 30, 40 pounds easily. Oh my word. Make sure you're checking out baskets if you are shopping online. Hannah, talk to me about Tanzanite. Oh, it's, just, it's, just it's one of those gemstones that is one locality gem. We're not gonna see it anywhere else in the world so far. And it's, it's just so incredibly rare. Blue being, obviously, the most popular color of choice for gemstones. If you ask anyone, blue is top of their list. And it's just being able to express just how beautifully rare this gemstone is to your customers, to your friends, if you're giving it as gifts. It takes your jewelry to that next level. Hannah, does it help? Sort of, you know, this gemstone gets a lot of press attention. It does, it does. Does it help taking perhaps some of those clippings, some of those oh, price absolutely. tags, showing some designs, and showing what's out there by some of the world's most famous yep. jewellers? Because they are, aren't they? They really are. And, and I just think, you know, if you do that, do, do your customers think, you're surely, oh my goodness, this is a jeweler's gemstone again. We've had so many incredible strands today. We really, really have 14.95. The price tag is super, super low, isn't it? Super, super low. Can everybody afford Tanzanite suddenly? Isn't this, isn't Tanzanite an out of reach gemstone? The, the last two months we have had strands of Tanzanite in like it's a regular thing. But it isn't, it's not, don't rely on it because remember there is only one mine in the world. One day this gemstone will run out, they say. I don't know when it is. I don't know how Hannah's got this, but aren't we so glad she's with us. BRJ N6850 carats and the graduations are between six by four to 12 by nine. Talking about an 18 centimeter strand. I'm feeling too high end. Let's continue with something that will go beautiful. This will go beautifully, not beautiful. This will go beautiful. Have a look at what I've got for you. Look at those colours together. Mm. Hmm. Look at that. Have a look. I'm sorry if you're if you're hearing a bit of a commotion. Have a look. Now I'd put these with gold. Wouldn't you? I love them. Now these are genuine ruby. They are going under 10 pounds. You need to be on the phone lines now because this is gonna sell out. I'm pretty sure of it. How many have we got, Laura Androliosho? We got 500. 
which you think is a lot, but it isn't. These are genuine ruby. These are July's birthstone. I looked at these this morning and went, oh, I love those. They're so different to anything else that we've seen. Have a look at the texture here. They look very natural. They're unpolished, which I love about them because you can see this gemstone for its raw form. You can see this gemstone for exactly what it is. It feels like it just came out of the mine. You know, this is wonderfully texturized, Hannah. And what a huge carat weight of ruby, 150, one carat in a ring. Oh, one carat beautiful. is a big carat weight in a ring. You've got 150 carats of ruby, so we'd expect to pay 20, 30 pounds for a strand like this. It's genuine ruby, a precious gemstone, a precious gemstone. Mm -hmm. It's going on to 10 pounds, these will sell out, so please don't, I'd get loads of these. I'm gonna give you a price tag and then we're gonna pick Hannah's brains and, and ask her all about this wonderful strand. Uh, of course, one of the most famous gemstones in the world, get your certificate of authenticity. This is Ruby for 6.95 OMG. It's genuine, I can confirm this is genuine Ruby. I can confirm this is insanity as, <laughs> as far as prices are concerned. Hannah, talk to me about this luscious strand. It's so different, I want it just because it's different. Yeah, I mean the texture of it is just fabulous. It's it's like water-worn, you know that look where it's like, like really... Yes, like sea glass yeah, almost. Yeah, exactly yes. like sea glass. And for me, I just have to put this with gold plate wire. The gold wire will make this look I, so I agree. It's just all rich reds. I'm seeing Christmas strands. I'm seeing Christmas Day you outfits. You said the C word. I love you for it. <laughs> I don't say it often, but yeah, Christmas Christmas Day outfit. This is perfect with. Look at that. So You're nice. so right. I think it's quite Egyptian too. What about with turquoisey tones? Oh. I cannot believe how many of you are on the phone right now. I just had to check that it was right. I went, oh, there are so many of you just came in and like literally 20 seconds, everyone went mm -hmm. and just lit up the phone like six pounds and 95 pence. Goodness gracious me. This is a genuine strand of a ruby and you're going bananas. How many people are multi-buying? Colin, you've bought loads. Well done. Goodness me. Sadie, you've bought loads of these. Louise, you've bought loads of these. Oh my gosh. Faye, you're there buying absolutely loads. Donna, you've bought lots. Olive, you've bought lots. Sarah, oh my goodness. Everybody I think that's on the phones now is multi-buying. Gorgeous, the gorgeous strand for a tiny weeny price tag. Six pounds and ninety-five pence. It's not bad, is it? It's not bad at all. I can't, how many have we got left? But these are mostly sold out, aren't they? At that price tag, they've got to be. Goodness me. I would wire wrap these in gold wire. I would put these with gold balls in between them and make a gorgeous bracelet. I would cage these. There's a queue on the phone, nice. Please bear with it. You've got to check out baskets online. Otherwise, you do always risk missing out, especially with so many people multi buying, and especially with Ruby 695. Ruby 600, it doesn't calculate. Ruby 695, Hannah, I mean, how, what, why, when? Should this be the price tag? No, I mean, let's, let's be honest, no, it shouldn't be the price tag, but because of our buying power, we've been able to get a really, really good deal on these, and we'd like to offer that to our customers. Now, for me, gold wire twisted. You said the right words to me. Wire twist at all twisting up, really, really going to town on the wire and making those gemstones go further as well. Oh. Do you know what, Anna? You're just, you're talking sense to me here. <laughs> I love that. It, actually, this is a very sensible buy as well because yeah. if you want to make a profit, if you want to make um, Christmas decorations that last forever and ever and that are an heirloom, that are ruby, well, here we go. This is the strand for you to do it. How wonderful, six pounds and 95 pence. F-E-R-U-60 is your item code now. Have a look at what we've got. I'm just gonna give you the wire twister tool again. Have a look. 
This is easy, I can do this. <laughs> I, there ain't no problem. Now, this action. Oh, Ben, you've not been here. You lost your car keys. You don't know what this is. What is this sorcery? <laughs> what is this sorcery? Did you hear him? Well, Ben, I'm going to go over to Hannah so that I can show you. So that Hannah can use her sorcery on it. I am very excited by this new tool. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Did you like my action? <laughs> Come on. I'm like, you sane. Now, um, twist the tool, talk through it, tell us why we need it in our lives. And Ben hasn't been here, he's lost his keys. Where did you find them, Ben? They're in my jacket. All along, All they're along. in his jacket. All That's the, the first place you should have looked, you narnikin. Okay, so, why a twist at all? Wait, sorry, I'm so sorry. Oh, producer Hannah is, producer Laura is saying, Laura. wait, girls. Got carried away. Wait, because she talks like Yoda. Um, <laughs> she does not mmm, feisty. Um, she wants it. She's going to put the price out. Price I oh, will. Oh, sorry, Laura. Price I will. Fourteen ninety-five. Right now you Thank can carry you on. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, so basically we've got a set of pliers like normal pliers, but we've got this sort of barrel, if you like, in between. It's like a springy, majingy. You have to What's use this for? <laughs> <laughs> so, we open it up, place our unwound wire, we have to use our imagination here, and we squeeze, and as we squeeze, we push pull back. or pull that area there. Let me just get that right way around so I can do it. There we go, pull back. Right, go. Oh, yeah, it clicked, it, it clicked, it clicked. Clicked. Yeah, there you go, yeah, clicked, clicked in place. Mm -hmm. Pull that back and that has locked your pliers into place as well. That's not going anywhere. Now, what you would do, this end would be clamped on the table. I can hold it for you. Hold it, hold it tight. If you haven't got a clamp, what could you do? You could put Tie that, it to the doorknob? Yeah, tie it around the door, doorknob uh, and just use it that way. So what you're doing is, that's tight, that's secure, and you're pulling and as you pull and let go, yes it twists so actually what's happening when that's twisting these are flicking round but it yeah. needs to be really really held there you go there you go so you just do that you just do that Woohoo! you're not actually holding the pliers tightly because they are twisting as you pull the end of the barrel out you see that's got like a I can feel it. it I can feel it and that's actually just twisting twisting no. round and to release you just squeeze at Yay. the catch I can make a ring. Now, this is for your thicker gauges of wire. Um, so we're talking about your 1.5, yeah. your one mil. It, well, you could absolutely, you can do you your smaller gauges. Smaller of course well. you can. Of course you can. But it does what the other little one doesn't do. The other little one is our most popular yes. tool, actually. Yeah. Um, so that you really are loving your wire twisting um, at the moment. Now, thank you, my darling. That's and fine. we thank are going you. to stay here. And I am going to... I, I, I did put the, the washers aren't here, but literally the other wire twister tool. Talk me through mm -hmm. that, my darling, please. Okay, so this is obviously um, the same principle, but in um, not as heavy duty. So you've got a disc and a barrel. More, and a more portable then. Much more portable. And what you would do to the end of the disc, you've got these little holes. You'd wrap the wire through the ends there. You can wrap up to three strands, but obviously you're using lighter gauge wire. You would then tie those strands of wire to a door frame or a door handle, sorry, and then um, or a vice to clamp them in place, mm -hmm. and you turn. And as you turn, it twists the wire. As simple as that. You can imagine them going around and around yeah. like a maypole now. You can't, can't you? exactly right. This is me doing it. Now, of course, they are. It's like I'm going into a dream. Doo -doo 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 -doo. <laughs> Back in stock, and believe me, they don't stay around for long. Eight pounds and forty-five pence. We've been giving you this in bundles. You've asked for it on its own. So many of you have not been able to get hold of yours. Now's the chance. So make sure you are on the phone lines. Make sure you are checking out baskets because these are very, very, very popular. They sell out, don't they? Within they do. minutes. They do. Yeah, and it's a really, really lovely, handy tool to create a different texture to your wine. Fantastic. Don't forget your 30 day money back guarantee applies on everything that you buy from us here at Jewelry Maker. And the code that you need is ERBN53. Now, thank you, my lovely. Welcome. I'll be back over later to have a look at your challenge. You've done very well indeed. So let's go and give you your Morganite. Uh, we've, I hope you've gone and had a little search engine on this fantastic gemstone because it is one of the world's most exclusively beautiful gems. 
Let's give to you now, your Morganite. I have got these wonderful trillions, never seen before. The largest Morganite that I've seen here at Jewelry Maker. Certainly a must have strand for me. And a lot of you are shopping high end today. So I do think you need to be back on the phone. Now, Laura's been researching Morganite jewellery and I'm going to give you a little bit of a, an insight on the prices that you can expect to see out there in some of the high-end jewellers. But this is a gemstone. In fact, the, the whole key to this, in fact, is that this is a gemstone that you'll find at high-end jewellers. It is. And why? Because it's one of the world's most exquisitely beautiful pink gemstones. This is a gemstone that was said to be in the Marilyn Monroe collection. It's very classic Hollywood. Think Marilyn Monroe, think Elizabeth Taylor, think about those wonderful classic movies with those beautiful feminine ladies who wore uh, incredible outfits, beautiful jewellery. Discovered by George Frederick Kuntz, the same chap that discovered Kuntzite. This is a must have a must have strand laura's seeing morganite pendants for 700 pounds one smaller drop for 495 pounds on an internet search and those are those are smaller carat weights than the ones you're seeing in any one of these pendants now Morganite is exquisite and exclusive the world over. Beautiful, a new find as far as gemstones are concerned. Do you remember the year that this was discovered? Was something like that. 19? Yeah, it was in the 19s. Yeah, yeah, so, so, so in fact, well, just like Tanzanite, very, very recent find as far as, as gemology is concerned. 60 carats of Morganite, let me count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine nine on the strand if these were 90 pounds and they were 10 pounds each if it comparatively you're getting a great price they're not 90 pounds they're not 10 pounds each you're getting this strand for under 50 pounds it is a gems of distinction strand of course exquisitely beautiful utterly feminine for you if you want to create high-end luxurious pieces of jewelry here is the strand of which you'll want to do it. Are you ready for another wonderful price tag? Today has most certainly been a luxurious day. If you bought the glass slipper strand, you'll want this one to go with it. Now you're already buying this on the website. Let's give you your price tag. Under 30 pounds, at under 50 pounds, I thought you were getting an incredible deal, but under 30 pounds, make sure you are putting this in your basket. Make sure you're checking it out and make sure you send us your wall of fame entries because we can't wait to see the exclusive, exquisite piece of jewelry that you create out of this wonderful strand. Whether you're going to put some silver wire through that top drill hole, wrap it tightly around, create your own loop, and put it on a sterling silver chain. Maybe it's gold that you want to put with this. Maybe you want it to be uber feminine and uber expensive looking. At 29.95, you've got that opportunity. Lots of you are buzzing around the website today. You must check out baskets. You will risk missing out if you don't. Very popular already. 40% of this strand has gone and sold out. It was a limited edition strand. We never had many of them. Never many were commissioned. We don't see Morganite like this. Hannah, tell me why Morganite is so hard to source. It's just one of those gemstones that doesn't have an abundance of high quality raw material. Um, it's, it's one of those things, it comes into the marketplace and we buy as much as we can, just like you've seen with the Tanzanite. We buy it because we don't know when we'll be able to get it again. If ever. If ever, yeah. It is, is just one of those gemstones. And we're not ones to drip feed. We like to go, look what I've got, woohoo! We're like Santa like that. And you're just like, Cal calm down, just give it us over the end. No, you want it now. <laughs> Here it is. We don't know if we'll ever get this back. So right now, make sure you're grabbing it with both hands and running. £29.95 from the Gems of Distinction collection. Something exquisite for your designs. Now, make sure you are, like I said, thinking about checking out baskets. Now we're going to go and give you 
some fabulous findings. I actually think rose gold is a, I think it's probably one of the best precious metals to go with that morganite, isn't it? Because it's the pinky. Now I'm going to give you the crowns, which I love. Have a look at this. Now, little gorgeous crowns. Aren't they cute? Have a look. I love these. I love these crowns. Now these look good on the top of a polymer clay frog. For the prince frogs. Don't you think? These also look great if you're making angels. I want to make a polymer clay frog. I said this last time. I love crowns. I just think they're so cute. You can flatten them into stars, but why would you? No, says Anna, don't flatten them. What would you do with these hand hands? I like using these um, either side of my sort of precious, um, if you came in and got the sort of mandarin garnet that we had, the round stones. Oh. Just to really highlight and just show just how exceptional those pieces are. Just framing them. And you've also got sterling silver and rose gold faceted balls. Now I love those. This is expensive. Expensive looking. Oh, today is luxurious. Laura and Drolia, you've been thinking about handbags and shoes again, haven't you? Gorgeous. Look at all of these. Wowzers, Magosos. Now you get rose gold. Oh, are these on copper? The little faceted ones, they look like silver. The quality is amazing. How many of those do I get? Loads. What, a thousand? Yeah, the bead caps are sterling silver. There's more than 195 in here. That's not 195 grams. Don't you reckon it looks like there's way more? It is 195. I know it is, yeah, it is. They just look more, don't they? So you've got sterling silver and you have got the rose gold. I love the crowns. They also are stars, obviously. I've put them up as crownies. We're going to give you a great deal on your rose gold embellishments. There are lots of you on the phone lines for these ones. Love to have your company this morning. What are you doing, Anna Roxbury? Just making noise again. Sorry. I know why you're making noise, lady. <laughs> Let me just reiterate what you've got here. 195 of the e-coated copper with rose gold balls. And you have got, how many of these do I get? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten sterling silver with rose gold crowns. All. What? What? I'll give you what? 795. Under ten pounds, you get ever such a lot. Rose gold. Talk to me about everybody's. Everybody's yep. wearing rose gold right now. Anna. It's because it's such a warm colour, so it suits any skin tone. And mm -hmm. you, it's it's actually quite fascinating. As soon as you start making with rose gold, people will pick it up on your stand because it is warm, inviting, luxurious looking, and also it's it's just not as harsh as what yellow gold can be. If you've got a yellow gold finish, a lot of people think, oh, you know, it's not quite me. But again, perhaps too pale to wear silver. Yeah, me, that's me. Yeah, so you come in and get the rose gold because it's perfect. And perfect it's pretty. Skin it's mm. pretty. It tends to, it's, it's a lot in designers out there at the it's, moment, it though, is isn't it? It is very heavy in design. Mm. So if you want the gemstone that is right here, right now, the wow factor, not gemstone, precious metal, then this is your <laughs> 7.95, very, very wonderful price tag. Don't forget, you've got 10 sterling silver crowns with the rose gold overlay. Everything's been e-coated to make it hypoallergenic. And don't forget, you have got absolutely stacks and stacks of the balls that are on copper, copper balls on uh, rose gold, sorry. You've got loads of those. All e-coated again, RCG, C85 is your item code. Now, my lovelies, hang on a minute, let me tidy away. So I'm rolling today, obviously. Mm -mm -mm -mm, la la la. 
<laughs> now, which number? The number five, yeah? Oh, 19, that doesn't sound anything like five, does it? Have a look. Oh, yeah, yeah, I do like this. She loves me, yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought Ben would carry on then, but he never. Come on then, have a I look at this. Of the German version. What German version? They released it in German. What, and what was it in German? It's like, she lived it, ya, ya, ya. Danke, song. danke. <laughs> Schnitzel. Have a look at this. Thanks, Ben. <laughs> Is it me? When I go to Germany, I used to go quite a lot, and I'm going to say something really controversial here. Is schnitzel just another version of the turkey burger? I'm just putting it out there. <laughs> I'm just putting it out there. It's nice though. I mean, I like it, mm. but it's just a turkey burger. Have a look at this. I love Germany. I used to go to Cologne. It's an amazing place. Now. Have a look at this. If you're German, let us know. My friend Dagmar, I say this to her all the time, and she's like, no. German markets are ace. Oh, marzipan, Christmas markets. Mm -hmm. Have a look at these. Now, you don't just get these two shell pearls, which I love. Now, these are snaz-tastic. Mm -hmm. I'm thinking about pushing my um, friendly plastic through these. Do you know that? They could be used or polymer clay. Mm -hmm. What would you do with these? Lovely to have a new shape, but I don't mm. necessarily know what I'm going to do with them, but I love to have them. Do you know what I mean? Do you do that? I love new shapes, and these are quite interesting because actually they're a take on a very high-end designer logo, Van Cleef. Yes, they are, aren't they? <laughs> Laura went, woo! They are! <laughs> You so, could, yeah, use those as a frame and put your jewel enamel in them, polymer clay, friendly plastic look amazing mm -hmm. inside mm -hmm. to really epitomise that particular logo. You're a minky monkey. That's naughty, but it's quite good, isn't it? So mm -hmm. you could use these as moulds if you're trying to... Um, if you were trying to be inspired. I'll leave that one with you. <laughs> Oh, I need it now. Mm. Oh, I need it now. I need these ones. <sighs> Have a look. Ryan's girlfriend's very excited by the prospect of a new handbag for Christmas. <laughs> Laura Androlia is just totally loving it. Oh, she won't out until Christmas, said Ryan. <laughs> God, I tell you what. I think I need to make some more demands at home. This is crazy. I don't. Uh, stylish. This is called Stylish. Now, these orange agate... Is it hard to cut? Hang on, I'm just thinking about this. How on earth? You don't pour these gemstones into a mould. How do you cut these? Yeah, with great difficulty. I mean, this is, cr this is really difficult to cut. Mm -hmm. Exactly the same, like this. They don't come in tubes. Nope. It's not like you can push them through the extruder. <laughs> it isn't. That, no, do you know what I mean? It's like, right. hang on, let's appreciate what we've got here. Oh, isn't it clever? Isn't this clever? The lapidary is all... And look, you can see all these lovely stripes. These are fab. And you can dangle something in the mm. middle of them. RRG C45. You could, you could dangle one of these pearls. They, I quite like the idea of them being belt buckles. Yeah, actually. that's very funky. Mm. They're only 11.95 for three. So that is less than four pounds. Per strand, think about the lapidary that's gone into this. The two perfect um, shell pearl strands. And when you, and shell pearl isn't faux pearl. Talk to everybody, what is shell pearl, Hannah? Shell to explain pearl that. is reconstituted pearl and shell which has been ground down and mixed with a type of resin hardener and then moulded into a perfectly round shape. So it is actually made out of shell and pearl? Yeah, yeah, ground up when we want that perfect round and we can't afford perfect round pearls because they're thousands. They are thousands. These are perfect. Exactly. 11 95 for that perfect pearl look. Not faux pearls, shell pearls. Ah, RGC45 is your item code. Make sure you're checking out baskets and remember your 30 day, no questions asked, money back guarantee. Now, let's do 
box, una dos tres cuatro cinco. Let's do cinco. These little buttons are super cute. Have a look. Cinco, cinco. Have a look at these. And this, you get these times two. I like the way it is like hot chocolate, isn't it? Chocachino, you want a chocachino? Oh, it's called hot chocolate, mmm. Have a look. <laughs> Laura, I love hot chocolate and marshmallows and cream for Christmas. <laughs> you have it every day, you liar. Now, these are gorgeous because they sit flat against the skin. Talk to me about the elegance of the colour and, and because you've got that pearlescence with shell, and it's a great, it's always a great price tag. Where mm. would you put these shapes and sizes though? What are they good for? These sort of things are good for if you want to do a little runner across the front of a hair comb or around a tiara band, would look amazing Yes, with these. they are. I'd mix them in with the sort of copper coloured wire mesh as well mm. to create a fascinator. But also it's just, it's just the sort of thing you need as a stash staple because you've got that pearlescent luster. It's not as harsh a colour, it gives a really, really soft, look if you're trying to introduce darker colours to your wardrobe this is a great great way to do it now these could be buttons as well oh, in fact yeah. couldn't they a lot of people are very um very much looking to make button jewelry and this is a great one for that now the thing that i love about working with shell is that i can be quite heavy with it i could put quite a lot of it in my jewelry yes, right. and it's very lightweight it feels as light as a feather and sometimes you want weight sometimes you don't so when i'm looking to really go to town with a piece I don't want it to be too heavy when it's go a bib necklace because I don't like the feel of that personally. Mm. Um, so these are great if I want to use a lot of wire work but I do want to use gemstones and I don't want to feel like I can't breathe when I'm wearing it, then this is the one that I'm going to go for. KTGC55, you have got two lots of the uh, puffy coins, they're 10 by 10, and your wheels, you've got two of those, they're four by two. So four strands in total, definitely an autumnal one. Oh, what about with your sunstone? Oh, mm. yes. If you've got any moo kite, that'll go great with that too. Four strands, three, six, nine, twelve, for less than three pounds each. It's a great deal. I had to do it with my fingers. Eleven ninety-five with a thirty-day money-back guarantee. It is so lovely to have your company this morning, my lovely jewelry makers. And you know what? You're getting super involved today. Thank you so much. We're going to give you more treats. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Didn't know you were, didn't know you were going to look at me hands there, Ryan. Now, oh, Ryan. Box Ryan. Let's go with box three rather than box Ryan. Ryan hasn't got a box. Now, is this what I think it is? Are you serious? How much is this going to be? Don't do anything sneaky. Do you know what this is? <laughs> no, I don't actually. This was snuck in. Look, look. How new is this? You're insane. This should be like a hundred quid. Look at that. Like, are you mad? Are you actually mad? Why, why is this? Look, you're going to get a ridiculous price on this Tanzanite. Tanzanite, look at the size of it. No, it's not anywhere near a hundred quid. It's not anywhere. This, both of these aren't even gonna be anywhere near 30 quid. Yes, it is, Cal Sydney. Look at the color of it. Proper navy blue. The, the price you're gonna get is ridiculous. Ridiculous, Laura. But there's so much of it, it's a lovely blue. It's not pale. No, it's really this is nice. not a pale blue. The paler, 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 the Tanzanite, usually the, the lower the cost. This is not pale. And they are huge. Thank what you. a lovely, lovely treat. I don't even believe that. I didn't even know this strand existed. Oh, I want that with a ruby. I away. want it with a ruby too. That's a great idea. Okay, Laura's going under £20. If you don't get this, it's absolute madness. You're, you won't forget it. You will regret it. You need to be on the phone lines. If you miss out, 
17.95 for these tanzanites you right if, if we wanted to if we wanted to if laura didn't tell me right these are this price these are this price sorry ryan now if laura wanted to she could tell us that this strand was a lot 80 quid 90 quid whatever i could stand here and tell you why it was worth it the carrot weight is amazing now this is a great treat for you you have got to be very 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 quick in grabbing these big beautiful gorgeous tanzanite unbelievable look at that color look at that color Ryan, JBG C83 Luxury Blue. I can't believe these rough nuggets. 7 by 3, 17 by 9. 18 centimetre strand. And your blue cows. We never see blue cows suddenly. They're 12 mil rounds. They're gorgeous. Hannah, this is an ins. These are going to sell out. Um, talk to me. Tell I, me do, I just want them. I want wire twister, gold wire, mix it in with the ruby. And it's, for me, just the perfect combination. I think they look amazing. You. Cannot buy tans no. like this price tag, can you? Anyone no, else? not not even close. I can't even begin to arrange this in my brain. This is a strand of rough tans. I mean, it's tans. Like, look at the colour. If this was a hundred quid, I would not even. I wouldn't sniff. I wouldn't. I wouldn't say no. Do you know what I mean? It would be fine. It would be justifiable. Hmm. It is real tanzanite, right? Right, Anna? Of course, absolutely. Yep, lab tested. Authenticity certificates. Even. Certified. Certified. Yep. Certified. <laughs> Certified. Certified. Crazy. I just think this price tag is insane. I love that you're getting it for this price tag. I do. Wow. Wow. The major wow factors here. There is a queue on the phone lines. You are getting a ridiculous deal. I don't know how it's happening. What do you mean, do I want another wow? You think that's a wow? Says, okay, all right. You. Again, she's being a sneaky peeky. Oh, hang on. I'm back. <laughs> You're making me feel a bit edgy today oh, no. with all these prices. <laughs> a strand of emerald, I love emerald, maize mm. birth gemstone. How much is it going to be? <sighs> Under 15 quid <sighs> for emerald. Two, this is a double strand, this is a strand of emerald. Let's get jewellery making with a precious gemstone. Let's do it. You need to be quick. VNG C55. I'm going to give to you this incredible gemstone with head pins. 20 of them. Sterling silver head pins. 20. It's called the Emerald Duo. And you're going to get it for under £20. Under £15. This is insane. Again, another wonderful deal for you, Emerald. Cleopatra's favorite gemstone, a birth gemstone, May's birth gemstone, going crazily, crazily at just 14 pounds and 95 pence. Two strands of emeralds, 20 sterling silver head pins. Look at the size of these emeralds. Hang on a minute, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. If somebody came up to you in the street, just some random gemologist, handed you an emerald and said, you can have this, a little bit like Jack and the Beanstalk with yeah. the man. It's like Jack and the Beanstalk, magic beans. You can have this emerald for 14 95 You'd bite their arm off Course for it. Would. Of course you would. That's crazy prices. Unbelievable. Don't forget you get the head pins as well. And you've got one PMP all day long. You're not even going to have to pay any extra. Wow. Well, all of this could just be a necklace on its own, an emerald necklace. I wouldn't. Do you know what I would do if I was selling my jewellery? Use them all individually and they would be rings and I'd make loads. Mm -hmm. I'd make loads. I, li I like making loads. Do you make... Would this be a good profit maker for you? Make sure you download your certificate of authenticity because I think sometimes your customers might say to you, 
as if you've got emerald, you're not a jeweler's. And you're like, not that your customers speak to you like that, but you know what I mean, that's the general <laughs> attitude, as if. You know what I mean though, you, you know how they can be the, I don't believe you. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, but you're not a jeweler. Well, you know what? Doesn't mean you can't use the gemstones that jewellers use. We can all be jewellers, can't we? Of course we can. Of course we can, darlings. Now, how do we follow that? Let's do some more wire treats. You all right there, Hannah? I'm making so much noise today, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'll tell you what. What are you making noise for, darling? What's going on over there? Just dropping things. Oh, OK, fine. I, I'm a girl with that um, kind of heart, droppy heart. Now, 15, number 15. 16, number 16. I don't know why I've lost the ability to hear numbers today. <laughs> 0 0.6 and 0 0.8. Great with the emerald, great with the ruby. Anything, really. Hannah, you did say it's got to be gold wire. It's got to be. It's got to be gold wire, twisted. This is the perfect, perfect bundle. If you've got the ruby, come in and get this. And I really, really want to see them on the Wall of Fame because I just, oh. I can't wait. I really want to see what people do with these. Me too. I, li I like the idea of prong setting them too, do oh, you? Yeah. Now, you've got 0.6 and 0.8. Talk to me about the benefit of having both in my collection. Well, your 0.6 is perfect for your findings um, and also any wrapping you want to do, whereas your 0.8 affords you more stability in a piece. You can make frames. But it's still flexible, That's right? It's still very, very flexible, yeah. Because a lot of the, we say you can make frames out of one mil, 1 1.5. It, it's all about the thickness mm. here. Obviously, the 1.5 is going to get thicker and thicker. So if you really want to make a big structure, go for that. But this one allows you to do a Laura binding style pendants, yeah. doesn't it? Yeah. In fact, I've got a bit of an example. You can gizmo with it. And who does not want to create? I'm just going for a little walk. Who does not want to create this little beauty here? Yeah. Perfect. You know I can't stop. I can't. I love it. They are amazing. What about this? Who did this? Rachel Norris. Who, sorry? Rachel. Rachel Norris. Wowzers. I mean, that's just fab. Wow. Unbelievable. If you want to be inspired by Rachel Norris, go and check her designs out on Facebook. Karen Crawford. Mm. Karen Crawford is a genius too. So is Gemma Crow. So is Laura Binding. So is Hannah Oxbury. If you love your wire work pieces, if you want to be able to do it, come through on one of our workshops. Laura's there today with a right noisy bunch. There have been a lark in there. You could also go and have a look at our free tutorials online, jewelrymaker.com. Grab one of our DVDs, anything from Wire Work for Beginners to more intermediate projects. Time to get working with Wire when we give you deals like this one. Two reels of gold, one in a 0.6, one in a 0.8, going, that's 200 meters, going low at just 32 pounds. These should be over 40 quid, shouldn't they? It should be £45. At £32.95, you've got yourself an awesome deal. LEG C72 is your item code. Now, make sure you're checking baskets out for that one, my lovelies. Oh, this is very luxurious again. Listen. They're fab, aren't they? Now, look at these. I would make, you know, sometimes when you just want a strand that sort of does it all the work for mm -hmm. you. Look at that. Look. Look at that. Yeah. Wow. Hannah, would you just 
unstrand that and redo it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, definitely. I would come in and I'd get the rose gold beads that we had on earlier in the big bundle with the crowns and I'd space them in between each of these little chas any drops because I just, like you say, the work is already done for you. It's a really tribal inspired strand. Look at the blades. It's just beautiful. I think, have you ever seen Mad Max? Yeah. The Tina Turner, that's what this is reminding me of. Look at that. Gold coloured agate with the blades, 13 by four to 70 by five. Your green pyrite rounds are three mil and your plain pyrite rounds are five mil. We don't have very many five mil rounds. If that's something that really excites you, get on the phone. I love this bundle. Mm. I think it's very, very, it's kind of sunset chic is what I'm thinking. Is yeah, it you? Definitely. That with antique bronze wire. All of this for 14 pounds, less than five pounds a strand. I paid for the cow said me alone. Those are big statement, gorgeous gemstones on a strand. 14 pounds and 95 pence IKG C32. It is so lovely to have you on board. It really is now, my darlings. Let's go and visit Lady Oxbury of Eversham. <laughs> is that where you live now? Pershaw. Oh, Pershaw. I, I do like Pershaw. It's lovely it in nice. the Christmas time. Bit of Broadway as well. Bit of Broadway, nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Now, oh, I love this. Love this too. Oh, you've been busy. Been busy, busy little bee today. You have, haven't you? I'm stealing those little earrings of pearls on. Those getting my ears. Look at the, like this. Mm -hmm. Love this. Something a bit different, isn't it? It's just that heart really makes it completely different. Yeah. It it's makes the piece a little bit more trendy, a little bit more now, but it's not over the top. It's still really, really wearable. It's quirky, but quirky. stylish. Very quirky. 1995 was the kit to price tag, and then Hannah's added the little embellishment of her own acrylic fingerprint there. That's wonderful, that heart, isn't it? <laughs> and then we've got, and I love these charms. This would be a lovely anklet. Yeah, it would actually. If you, if you didn't have cankles like, like me. me. <laughs> have a look. Isn't that pretty? Love this too. What I love is, have a look at the use of bead of the bead cap. I'm gonna turn it around for you. Don't forget this, the kit was solid sterling silver find. I thought it was more expensive than 1995. Oh, it's got the copper, yeah, 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 sorry. Then you've got these luscious earrings. Lovely earring collection here, really elegant mm. hands. I love, I love the leaves. Yeah, they just add something a bit different to they the do, piece don't as well, they? don't they? It's really, really, really pretty. But again, love very, it. very simple. Very simple. Now, we've got all of this for you in a kit, 1995. Two strands of pearls, mm -hmm. two strands of sodalite, 100 findings, everything that you need for just 1995. Don't forget your 30 day money back guarantee. It's got the wow factor. I love that. Don't forget if this is your first purchase with us today, a free tutorial book and DVD is all yours. Brand new today. Now, we have got some visitors. We have. Which, we, are we going to go now or we're we going to see them in a minute? Let's go now. Should we go now? Should we go now? Let's go now. You come in with me, Ben. Hello. Are they coming in or are we going over? You coming over? I'll come over. Come for a visit. Yeah, you coming come to play? Come coming out to play? I'll Let's go, go Laura. You go by Laura's. <laughs> now, um, Laura Binding, the lovely little pup that she is, has had <laughs> a workshop. <laughs> Where are you going? Don't <laughs> trip me up. <laughs> I don't. Oh, just stay Sorry, here then. I'm Next time, you know, don't just, just anymore. No, just Stand stay where you are. You're too small. I can't see you like a little Jack Russell. <laughs> trip over you. Now, um, Laura Binding has had the workshop in today, and they've been doing intermediate wire work. If you'd like to get involved in one of Laura's courses, if not for the wire work, for the cups of tea that she makes, then uh, give Kirsty a tinkle. 0800 six triple four six double five. They did look like they were having ever such a lot of fun today. Now, um, ladies, hello. We haven't got time to talk to everybody, uh, but it is lovely to meet you all. 
You're doing uh, wire working. Is she being good to you? Is she being oh, good to you? Excellent. Excellent. Yeah, Who's been wire working for a lo the longest out of all of you? It's good. I love this. A couple of years. A couple of years? Yeah. A couple of yeah. years. So, uh, uh, anybody quite new to wire work? Very new. Oh, okay. We've got four very new <laughs> wire workers here. Um, how long have you been wire working for? Um, about two hours. <laughs> no, no. But this is the intermediate course. Yes. You just threw yourself into the deep water. Yes. And it's fine, you're good. Brilliant. I'm going to give you the microphone so Thank that you can. You. Now, did you, so you didn't make what you're wearing here? No, no, I didn't. But I did make a ring that I'm very, very proud of. And what, so what have you done so far today? Um, learned two different kinds of weaves. Okay. And made a ring. And where are you going to take this? Is this, have you been jewelry making for a long time? Um, probably about 18 months, but I've never done wire work before because I've always been really afraid of it. A lot of people do say that they're afraid of wire work, yes. so this is great. So come along on a course and Absolutely. you're all right now, are you? feel OK? Brilliant. Yeah, I said to Laura, I said, I'm showing everybody, aren't I? Look what I've made, look what I've made. <laughs> Brilliant. You just feel it's proud really of yourself. Yeah. And you've been um, jewellery making for a long time. I'm gonna, just going to pass the, yeah, sure. the uh, microphone along. <laughs> so let's see from the other side of the coin. How long have you, two years? Yeah, a couple of, couple of, couple of years. Um, my work was very, very basic to start off with. I just wanted to learn how to do it neatly and properly. I'd sort of made it as long, long, long as, as I went along, but I wanted to know how to do it properly and get it neat and get the tensions and things right. So that's where I came. Fabulous. So are you, is Joy making a business for you? It's part-time business, yeah. Okay, fab. Yeah. So, and wire work is definitely where you want to go. Yes. Brilliant. Yes. So, Laura, yeah. you would recommend every ladies to come Indeed. along, oh, yes. definitely. meet definitely. Laura, have one of her famous yeah. cups of tea. Yes. Oh, yes. Definitely. definitely. Are you having a laugh in there anyway? Because we can hear you like, woo! <laughs> <laughs> definitely having some fun oh, in good, there good today. Fun. Now, has anybody got any special hellos they've got to say? Oh, just a husband and daughter. Oh. Where, where are husband and daughter? Near Bedford. Near Bedford. Oh, that's yes. where I've come from. Yeah. Oh, we live near each other. Whereabouts do you live? Toddington. Tod oh. Yeah, see, we come down the M1 today, <laughs> did we? We did. We could have given you a lift. Yes. Could have given you a lift. My daughter lives in, oh, like, practically lives in Bedford because her friend lives there. <laughs> now, um, wonderful to meet you. I'm so sorry we didn't get time to say hello to everyone, but you've been busy. And, yes. and so have we. Yeah. We've had so much to pack in. Laura, any last words from Laws? Let's pass the microphone yeah. along to Laura. <laughs> uh, Laura, tell me about um, how today's gone in a nutshell and when your next wire work course is. <laughs> um, I think it's done really, really well. And I, the next one's on the 30th of October. OK, so, so everybody's doing well, no troublemakers. Yeah, they're, they're doing really brilliant. No, they're doing really good. Oh, good as gold. Good. <laughs> <laughs> All behaving themselves. <laughs> I don't believe any of you. <laughs> there's always a troublemaker. Come on in. Uh, we saw there's a guy in there today as well. Yeah. Didn't get him out here, did you? Now, come on over. I'm going to trip over Hannah Roxbury again. Thank you, ladies. <laughs> Lots of love. Now, um, I'm just going to give you a little bit of a refresher on our barrel stand that we bought for you earlier. Hannah, talk to me about the sheer beauty of this wonderful strand. A lot of people have been asking so, to see it yeah. again. The clarity of this piece is second to none. It's, it's honestly the best barrel I've seen. On I the agree channel. with you. I'm thinking uh, aquamarine like this. Is, we've seen topaz, but like this, not aquamarine. I mean, this is wow factor. It's got yeah. the X factor, this strand, hasn't it? It really has. So yes from me. Yes from me. Yeah. And what about you, Sharon Osborne? Uh, ben? Yes. <laughs> it's fabulous. Look at this clarity. <gasps> Oh, are you staring into the window of a high-end jewellers? Don't you think? Yeah, definitely. I'm trying to grab it on the screen, the screen then. Want it? Oh my word. Just look, just look. Mm -hmm. just twinkling away, aren't they? It is beautiful. Hannah and I are in a barrel state of mind here, just like, mm. just want look, that. look at it. Mm, on the big screen hands, look at it. Just want it, just want it. Isn't it gorgeous? Just want it. Just want it. We're not allowed them. Not till last minute. No. We're allowed no, them tomorrow if there's any left. Oh, Hannah, my darling. They're only 19.95. Good grief, Penfold. Now we've loved having you here today. Thanks. Tell everybody when we can see you next. Also, I want you to give me a little bit of insider gossip. What's coming to us here at Jewelry Maker, if you've got any? And if not, I want some. <laughs> What's coming to us? We've Who's got... snogging who? I want to know everything. I don't even know that. I don't know that sort of thing. I'm so busy working. But we've got 
brand new storage bags coming and they are amazing. How so? What do they look like? Tell me everything. Uh, they've got fold out pockets, so brilliant for craft. How big are they? How big are they? Uh, one's this big, sort of like a folder. Box or bag? More like a bag, baggy thing. Okay. It's amazing. Just wait, you've got to, yep. you've got to see it. It's amazing. What colour is it? Um, stripey. Like our other stripey, so it'll go. Yeah, all matching. Beautiful. I want myself one of them. Ben's doing an actual dance. Yeah, it's good. It's good. We've got lots and lots of amazing things on the way. <gasps> now, Hannah, you're going off to India. I would like you to bring back something. What are you going specifically to look at? We are looking at new packs of findings and new tools and new gemstones. So Woohoo! Lots, lots of goodies. Can't wait for you to come back with that. Now, um, five o'clock tonight, who is on? It's Ed with some crazy deals. So get yourself ready. Don't forget, tune in at five because Ed and Deanna have got some very cheeky things lined up for you. Keep it interactive in The Late Show because they love a bit of that. We are wishing you a very wonderful Saturday afternoon. Goodbye, my darling jewelry makers. We'll see you later. Do you need a helping hand to get started with Jewelry Maker? Are you stuck for ideas and need inspiration? Then visit our Jewelry Maker website where you can find our video tutorials. Expand your knowledge and skills with these easy to follow jewelry making demonstrations. Whether you're a beginner, hobbyist or business owner, there's always something new to learn. It couldn't be easier. Simply click and learn some new jewelry making techniques. The Jewelry Maker Wall of Fame is where you get to showcase your skills as a jewelry designer. And each week, one lucky entrant will win £100 credited to their Jewelry Maker account, and the runner up receives £50. If you want to enter your design, just send a photo to studio at jewelrymaker.com. Or you can post your photos to Wall of Fame, The Genuine Gemstone Company, Unit 2D, Eagle Road, Moon's Moat, Redditch, B989HF. We all know you need the right tools for the job. So here at Jewelry Maker, we have designed a kit to make sure you have all the essentials to join in with the fun. With round nose, flat nose and wire cutter pliers, as well as a reamer, tweezers and a bead scoop, you've got everything you need in one place for just 9.95. We provide the tools, you provide the skills.